All right. Well, we are back, huh? We're back at the Nine Club Experience, everybody. Episode 133, man. Mm. Get up. <laughs> How did I know? 33? It's a good number. It's a it great is. number. It is. It definitely is. It's an okay number. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> How's everybody doing? We good? We good. Yeah. Doing good. 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 Yeah, I've got my seventh cup of coffee. I'm fired oh, up. Fired up. Oh, oh, up. Boy. And we will mute his microphone. <laughs> Here we go. Starting. <laughs> Sorry, Kelly. Uh, <laughs> it's a shame. It's a shame. It's a we shame. do what we do, okay? We've learned our lesson. Yes. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> 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 Anyway, <laughs> no, man, we, uh, listen, all jokes aside, we, uh, we start the show with, uh, you know, heavy hearts, man, this, uh, Henry Gartland, um, passed away over the weekend. Was it the weekend? Cause we, we, it, I, I almost want to say it was Sunday cause I we filmed the show on a Sunday, but, or maybe it was Monday. I believe it was, uh, two weeks ago. Two, we, a week and a half, maybe. Week ago? and a half, yeah. yeah. Um, and that's why we didn't say anything on the last show because we had already filmed it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, uh, very sad. Um, Multi talented skateboarder, bro. So like, good. Yeah, yeah man. Skateboarding. Such a great, great skateboarder. Yeah, um, very sad, man. So, got a couple clips here. Dude, this Just grind to, was ins. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that was him that did that? Yeah, dude. He did some this was the first, fuck, yeah. fuck tricks, man. Till yeah. Death. Um, volume 1. Volume 1. Yeah. Yeah, yeah and then uh, it was in Volume 4 as well, I believe. Damn. That's crazy. That has to be like the most kinked mm -hmm. rail. I mean, super, chilling. Dude, yeah. super talented, man. Super talented. Yeah. Man. He's a so, good kid, man. Yeah. It's always, uh, it's always tough. You know, when somebody passes away. Yeah. It's crazy with this, like the amount of talent and, and what he did, like it makes it so much harder to realize like why, you mm. know what I mean? Like, it's like, why, why would you, you know, I don't know. Like, it's just such a confusing thing yeah. to think about. Just to understand like what demons were you fighting in yeah there? it really is so confusing yeah to people that don't know he took his own life um super super sad man devastating bro yeah man um yeah lost for words yeah, yeah. It's, it really, it's, it's, yeah. it's tough man it's really tough um just you know, if you guys are, if anybody's having any issues out there or anything, man, like, listen, we all go through them. We all go through them. And, uh, you know, just talk to somebody, you know, mm -hmm. talk to somebody. Say something, somebody. Yeah. You know, yeah. You know, Robert Brink on his story brought up a really good point. And, you know, I'm a, obviously I'm an advocate for make sure your friends are OK. Check on your people, this, that and the third. But sometimes it goes a little bit deeper than that. Mm -hmm. You yeah. know what I mean? Sometimes it's not just about reaching out because that person even when you reach out might not have something to say at that moment in time mm -hmm. sometimes it's more or less like you know if you invite someone somewhere and they don't necessarily want to go it continue not don't overstep the boundaries but be like well what would you like to do right now is there anything that you know would make you happy or something that we could do to kind of get you out of that headspace because i even know for myself sometimes you don't want to go out to a crowded bar and be around a bunch of random people or, or go to an event or mm -hmm. a, a party or whatever. Like sometimes you just want to fucking like get pizza with your boy and kick it. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? And and that's when those conversations then can spark of like, you know, bro, this is what I'm going through. Yeah. yeah. And I think sometimes it's more of a uh, being a real friend and extending that 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 olive branch. And be like, okay, well, shit, I don't have to go. What do you want to do, bro? Let's kick it. Let's do something. Let's go fucking, I mean, obviously things are closed right now, but like, let's go to the batting cage. You know what I mean? Just like yeah, any, yeah. something to you like. You can make it, you know. can make, you can find a way to make it work. Right. And mm. I think that's super important and it's super valuable right now. And, and that's a lesson that we can all learn and myself included. I think we all really, uh, you know, pay attention to the signs. And sometimes mm. even when you reach out, they that, that, 
it might not be enough. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah. And it's difficult right now. Or it might given, not be the time at that yeah. moment. Yeah. But given the landscape of what's going on and you maybe can't hang out with people, mm. it's very, yeah. it's very trying times, you totally. know? Mm-hmm. And um, sometimes you just, I can't, like I, I just hang out with you guys here, you know, yeah. I, I'm not going in to a batting kit. You know what I mean? Like I'm just, yeah. I could see yeah, if you tough, don't have like man. a solid foundation behind you, you know Dude. what I'm saying? In a sense yeah. of like, whether it's your family or, you know, friends that you see on occasion more so than often, um, where at at this time and in, in this place and where we at with this whole pandemic and everything, like I could see how you can, you know, get dark and think Absolutely. dark and get in these yeah. dark places, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, at the end of the day, if you do have people to lean on and they are reaching out, you got to be understanding to be like, hey, you know, they're reaching out like there's somebody that's putting that hand out. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Whether it might not be the time, you know what I'm saying? you That person might need to reach back, you know, yeah, and, right, and I hate right. to say, you know, and put it in their court. And sometimes it goes that way. But all in all, man, we, we got to be there for each other yeah. at the end of the day at this at this time. So yeah. it goes both ways. Right. For it's, sure. It's mm-hmm. like if if you're the person that needs somebody you need to reach out multiple times and and the people that they're reaching out to if maybe you say no once or maybe you say no twice you you need to realize that like you need to say yes a couple times yeah. you know what i mean like right people- i mean sometimes it's also it's just i can speak from my own perspective you reach out to people whether it be a text message phone call whatever your means of communication are and a lot of people are going through their own things. A lot of people are busy right now. There's a lot of stuff that kind of comes into it. So sometimes you get to the point where you reach out so much that you're just like, well, fuck, I don't want to be a burden anymore. Right. You right. know, cause you're like, well, they, they, they've got their own shit too. Right. So then you get into your own head. So like you said, it's a two way street. We, we, we both have to, both sides of the coin have to be open. Mm-hmm. And I want to like, I want to shout you out and thank you for like reaching out to me this past week because that like, that meant so fucking much to me, bro. Yeah, man. For you to just like go out of your way and see that, you know, obviously with things that are happening right now, it's a lot more top of mind, but you know, we're boys Mm -hmm. and you can see when shit's not right. And I just want to say thank you for like being that, like being that homie and reaching out and just like hitting me up. Cause that, that's what matters. Cause I'm not, I'm not the type of person to like put my burdens on other people. You know what I'm saying? But like, and this isn't all about me, but I'm just using this as an example yeah, yeah. of like that is important mm, no and that needs mean. to be more not just with us, but just like across the board, like check on your fucking people, man. Yeah. On some but real especially shit. To, 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 speaking on that, when you get in your own head, you're your own worst enemy. Exactly. You know what I'm yeah. So I think that sometimes like that burden is fucking it fucks with you. Yeah, it really does. So I'm glad to see that, you know, obviously Kelly reached out and that, you know, that can, you know, whatever was going on, it makes that, 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 that situation, you know, that much tighter to get to where it needs to be at the yeah. end of the day. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, and look, this is yes, just, reach out to your homies. Exactly. That's yeah. a message for the world, everybody that's a part of this. Just make sure your friends are okay. Like, yeah. for real. Yeah. I mean, people say that a lot too, but do you actually act on it? Right. Like, right. do it. I mean, it mm. doesn't hurt. It's <laughs> call you up and talk. Like, mm. yo, we actually, it was cool to talk. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like check, check in, say yeah. what's up, you yeah. know? Yeah. yeah. And I think with, with just life in general, it's tough to reach out sometimes. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like I yeah. see you guys all the time, you know, but sometimes I think life gets the best of you, you know, and you don't yeah. reach out, you know? I don't yeah, know. Yeah, it's real it, shit. It's tough, bro. It's a, it's it's really tough and it's sad. So, but it goes both ways as well. Like we've been yeah. saying, you, if you're not feeling good, then reach out. It's to tough though other sometimes. It's, it's really tough because again, you're in your own head, and to reach out and just to kind of cold call somebody, right? And, you know, it. And it's then, tough to it's, talk it's, about. It's, it's, it's also ba- about. it's it's a lot of your conditioning of how you were brought up yeah. and how you've been built. And again, I can only speak from my perspective. I'm not trying to make this about me at all, but I'm only using my it's the best reference you have. My reference yeah. of yeah, like when you when you kind of grow up as someone who just has to kind of hold it in and man up and do what the fuck you're supposed to do, you carry that into your adult life. So I think a lot of times that happens with other people too, where 
you're just like, you just got to put a smile on. You got to do what's necessary because you're that, you're that rock for a lot of people. Mm -hmm. So sometimes it's difficult for that rock to crumble because who, who, who helps the person that helps everybody else? Yeah. Yeah. You know? So I think that falls on a lot of people's shoulders and it's a, you're a product of your environment. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Straight up. I, I'm, I'm that individual. Straight up. I try mm-hmm. to put on a fucking face every day and make sure that, you know, and I might have some shit going on. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But at the end of the day, you know, I, I'm a human, you know, and, and uh, yes, we we can, uh, for myself, I try to put on a face, a smile every day. I don't need to be showing people like no negative, no, like, yeah, here, here, feel for me. Like, no. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, we we continue down this road and streamline and you know and I'm a big up and po- be positive along this road. That's just the way I am. Yeah, straight up. Yeah, yeah. and this ain't about me. <laughs> like right. you saying, you know what I'm saying? This right. is just the reality of how I live. Yep. You know. And uh, if you don't have anybody to reach out to, we're gonna put some links in the description of the video below. Some uh, hotlines and stuff like that. So yes. if you are feeling you know a certain way. You know, there are people to call, you know, and sometimes I, maybe I feel like calling somebody that you don't know mm-hmm. is great because you can just talk to somebody. And no judgment. No yeah. judge. Yeah. You don't yeah. know them and they can possibly help you out of this situation that you're feeling, you know? Yeah. So we were going to put links in the description of the video below. So please, you know, if you are in a, in a, in a certain, you know, mind state, please reach out to, to somebody. Um, yeah, you know, it's amazing. Now. It's amazing when you just talk it out. How much better you feel after? Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know. Mm-hmm. So talking yeah. is very important. Yes, you know, it becomes I'm a burden, like, bro. Like you yeah. want to think about all this shit that you think that people are thinking or whatever the case is. Like you don't want to think about that. That's like extra shit that it's like <laughs> leave. You know what I'm saying? Get yeah. out of here. Like I don't want to think about that. You know. I, I read this shit the other day. It was like uh, overthinking. That's it's not overthinking. It's thinking about the wrong things. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And yeah. it's like, if you are yeah. thinking about the wrong things, they categorize that as overthinking. No, you have to think about the right things. And the right things, you need to talk to people. Mm-hmm. You need to express your feelings and, and we can all get through this together. Yeah. Totally. yeah. Talking is very powerful. Yeah. It's very mm-hmm. powerful. Definitely. So our condolences to friends and family, Henry, Henry Gartland, ma'am. Yeah, ma'am. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. Please uh, rest in peace. And uh, it was watching his footage. Man, God, so man. good, dude. Yeah, man. And everybody, the the way they talked about him. Yeah, I, I yeah. never met him, but man, if right. I could have hung out with him for, for sure. For sure. Yeah, yeah. No he seemed like a great, great dude. I didn't know him either. But uh, I feel like I know these people, too, because, you know, Santa Cruz, they do such a great job mm-hmm. yeah. in, you know, telling their stories yeah. and their life and stuff like that. So He had a true grit, right? We talked about yeah, it before. Yeah, we right? did. Yeah. We did. That's rad when they do that. It's so rad. It's so cool. You know. But anyway, please uh, reach out to somebody. If you're, yeah. You know, please. Yeah. yeah. If you have health insurance, look into therapy, yeah. whatever you can, you can do. Because I know a lot of people don't have friends or family to talk to yeah you know? yeah sometimes you just need like y'all saying you just need to get that shit out yeah, yeah. absolutely rest in peace yes, henry man. uh be truly missed truly missed oh, Definitely. Definitely. yep um man it's hard to transition i know yeah. it's, it's it's tough it's <clears> tough you can't even shake that off bro you I can know. i know but uh well we will say that uh we do have a raffle to get to later in the show. We have uh, yeah, this guy, this guy, Tony. Who? Who exactly? Tony where'd Hawk? Come, where'd he oh. come from? Yeah, we're... Tony Hawk. The Hawk Man? That guy? It's not, it's not ringing a bell. No? <laughs> I think you're talking about, uh, what is it? Uh, Peacock. Tony does, Peacock. Tony Tony Peacock. Peacock. I've heard of him. He's great. That, that He's a good man. Yeah. yeah. I don't know who this other hot guy is. The big of feathers. Tony Bald Eagle. Bald Eagle. Yeah. You've Tony been seeing Eagle. hella peacocks lately, huh? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> They're beautiful creatures. You got yeah. some in your neighborhood as well. <laughs> yeah. He does a lot of numbers, like 900, 720s. He's, oh. a, ver- he's a vert skater. And he skates trees too. Not you do some, no. He does varial flips, I think. 
Yeah. Oh, oh that's right. Yeah. The I think, varial flipper. I think you, yeah, 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 yeah. He's got the best varial flip in the game. He's the skate father. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bird man. It <laughs> is a shove it. Kickflip. Wow, that was aggressive. <laughs> that was. Tony, stop yelling at us, bro. <laughs> yeah, he did yell that one. Yeah, but later no, in the I'm show, we're going to pick one grand prize winner for the signed... I always pick them up upside down. <laughs> I don't know why. I do that. Uh, <laughs> signed Tony Hawk 720. Lat, I won't say his last 720, but it could be. We don't could know. Be. Okay, mm-hmm. yeah. Don't put it past him. Never say never with the Hawk man. Uh, we'll pick a grand prize winner. One winner. We'll win this later that in the show. That video went viral. Dude. Yeah. Sports Center. Yeah. yeah the everywhere. whole kit. Dude, Roger's Google alerts were going crazy. <laughs> <Roger's> <laughs> skateboarding, skateboarding, skateboarding. Dude, skateboarding. Boing, boing, <laughs> dot net. Like, what the fuck did you see? The boing. Yeah. Yeah. I thought it was Ragdoll talking to yeah. him. Yeah. I did I too. I'm not even joking. Yeah. It wasn't? Uh, no. No. I thought it was, um, <laughs> but I loved. I did like how Mind Club was mentioned in yeah, all yeah, these yeah. things. Yeah. Like, oh, Tony, wait till our stuff comes out. I know, <laughs> post right? Your stuff, bro. Come on, man. <laughs> Algorithm. No, no. Thank you, Tony, for the exclusive, bro. But uh, we do have, and we're going to pick three winners for the Tony Hawk boards that we actually did get signed. Oh. Uh, they weren't signed at the time, but uh, look at that, They're Tony Hawk. Now. Yes. Tony Hawk, bro. Some more some shit. That much more Thank special. you to uh, Tim Olson for uh, making all this happen. You Thanks, know. Tim. Tim. Timmy boy. Yay, boy. Our so guy. there's going to be four winners this week? There's going to be four winners. So yeah. three, three winners will win the Tony Hawk sign board, and one wow. grand prize winner will win his complete that he did the 720 on. Damn. Huh? Wow. Amazing. amazing. Put that, put, let's pick the winners like after the credits. We can put like 10 ads at the bottom. (laughs) (laughs) Thinking. You're hired. (laughs) Perfect. Uh, In this episode, we do have a a, a special one. We got a special raffle going on. We got, uh, well, I don't know if you guys seen the, uh, not you guys, but the guys out there. Uh, illegal sieve. They came out with a little video. I don't know. Mm-hmm. Little, mm-hmm. very small, <laughs> very, very small. <laughs> Million plus views in the first <laughs> week. I don't know. It's pretty, pretty good video. Eh. Yeah, I don't know if any videos are doing that these days. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, shout out to uh, Mikey Alfred and uh, Devonte Jolly. Bro. Yes, man. Yep. They actually they killed it, and all the people involved, all the skaters and everything. Hell but yeah. we do have uh, our boy Kevin White turned. Pro, along with Zach Cercino and Alex, Alex Midler, Midler, bro. So we are going to... Now, the thing is, here's the thing, okay? You know what? We got the we got the Kevin White boards, okay? Now we're supposed to get in three Zach Cercino boards and three Alex Midler boards. Oh, we don't snap. have them here, but we're supposed to get them in, in. by in, Friday, I believe. So transit, by the next yep. episode, we, will, we should have those in. So three boards, Kevin White, Alex Midler, and damn, Zach Cercino. That is damn. Three amazing. boards. So you're of, gonna, the pros. of the newest pro. The newest? The first pro. First yeah. pros. And Oh yeah, yeah, first and only. Yeah, first, yeah. <laughs> and they already, are they sold out already? Sold out. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. We yeah. we gotta wait for the other boards. Wow. They're yeah. getting, they're getting you might want to just collect these. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And yeah. try to get another Bro, one. Don't what do you, yeah. use them. What do you think we got this here? But this is going on the wall. <laughs> yeah. We already no, got a. Wa- we already got the wall hanger. There you go. <laughs> Yeah. We really got to get Roger some fishing wire. I know. Like, he, loves, he loves a shoelace. He I loves know, it. but he loves why? It. Uh, it's the way that he was raised. Bro. It's just like, just get a white one at least for that one, right? Yeah. Or, or, like, or get he, fishing wire. He's got a red one in the, the Krabi fucking <laughs> Fulfill the Dream board. <laughs> like, put, a, put a navy blue one. Yeah, in there, see? Bro. Fishing wire. Fishing hey, wire. Yeah. You guys are welcome to help out anytime <laughs> you want, guys. That's what I said. Uh, anytime you want to help out. That's why I said we need to get you some. <laughs> Fishing wire. That's, way, that's the way he's at. Yeah. Jesus is going to stop by the bait and tackle store on the way home. 1,000%. 1,000. You walk in there. The know. bait and tackle. Uh, fishing wire. Fishing wire, please. Can I get 1,000 feet of fishing wire? What are you wire? fishing for? No, just boards. Just I actually boards. have some in my house. So I do the same thing. There you go. Yeah, there you boom. go. And uh, as a special treat, man, we have Kevin White on the internet on the zoom call we're gonna uh, talk to kevin white yeah right yeah yes. why don't yeah. you ever tell us these things are happening <laughs> uh, i'd like to keep you on your toes <laughs> <laughs> yeah. we matter, need a foot crate cam like 
Dub said, for what? <laughs> for our shoes, so we can see what we're wearing. So you can see when Eldie's on his toes. I wanted oh, toes. Oh, oh, toes. Like, right right the dad see. joke went right over yeah, my yeah. head. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes it's he didn't even get that one. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so let's get Kevin White on the line, huh? Hey. Do this. Do it. Kevin White is with us via the internet. Yeah. Uh, what up, Kev? Yes, sir. Hell oh, yeah. Hey, first of all, Kev, I've known you for a little while now, and I uh, just want to say big congratulations. Big congrats, bro. Well deserved. Amazing. It is a lot, guys. Thank you. Bro. So sick. Hell yeah. And uh, it couldn't have happened to a nicer person. You know what I'm saying? We go back. You know what I'm <laughs> we go back, man. Bro, I, I think everybody in there go back a, a little bit with. Yeah. yeah. yeah I'm just hyped to see another fucking tall ass black dude out there getting it. <laughs> Straight up. Yeah, how tall are you? I'm like six four. Six four. Damn. Okay. With the hair, he's like six six. Six six. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right, right. Let, let me ask you. <laughs> hey, first of all, in all seriousness, congratulations, bro. Amazing. Yeah. And yeah, and man. two other dope dudes to turn pro with yeah. Alex Midler and Zach Saracena. Come on, bro. Like that's yeah. amazing. Yep. Yeah. Man. Great was, company. Wow. Great company. And also congratulations on the Godspeed video because in all honesty, like it doesn't happen anymore. Like that video got a million plus views in like the first week. Yeah. That doesn't happen. Yeah. Like, and that was mm -hmm. a full length hour plus video. Yeah. That yeah. doesn't happen, bro. And like I was saying on the show too, man, it's even just for this next upcoming generation, that's like a, a statement piece. You know what I mean? Like we don't really get those anymore. Those like mm -hmm. Chris said, full lengths, but like just the the group of people that came together to put that video together, all the skaters that were in it, that was like a that was a, a moment in skateboarding history, man. So congratulations to you and yours for that for real. Appreciate it. Um I just think like for most of us, that's what we came up off of. Like even like my generation, like a lot of us watched full length videos and that's what Jolly came up on. That's what Mikey made with IC two and three and I see the first one, even Spark of Life, like that's just like our formula. You know, like that's what we've been doing to like when it was Jolly's time to do what needed to be done, it was it was a no brainer, you know? And I love it, man, because I mean the formula nowadays is maybe not full length. It's like they break up the parts, they put it on Thrasher, they put it over here, they put it you know what I mean? And then you don't get the full you don't get it all together. Right. You know, and I think it just kind of goes to show like you guys really set the tone for for nowadays. It's like Yes, you still can do a full length video and people pay attention with the right crew. With happen. the right crew, too, yeah, for yeah. sure. Dude, literally, a full length video came out today by uh, Tristan. Like, oh, the, yeah, so sick. You know, they got they got the formula. They did their they did their stuff. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Exactly, exactly. But it's just not it's not a, it's not a lost art form. You know what I mean? Like everybody thinks that this this, this is a lost thing. Oh, full lengths are dead. Full lengths are dead. No, look at Illegal Civ, bro. Mm -hmm. You know, a yeah. million something views. That, yeah. It's unheard of. And the thing that I really enjoy too, and I, I, I joke about the VX thing all the time, but like y'all didn't need a gimmick to make it what it was. Like you came out full HD, everybody had incredible parts, all the skating spoke for itself. You didn't have to use a VX 1000 just to be trendy or to like, obviously people want to pay homage, but like y'all really came through and used what you have in today's day and age with the technology and you show improved and that's all that, that's, that's all that needs to be done. Mm -hmm. You know, when the content is there, people will watch no matter how exactly. long it is. Yeah, exactly. if it's a good video, it's a good video. Yep. Straight up. Yep. And that was a fucking good video. And it yeah. released on a good on Christmas Day, mm -hmm. too. Ooh. That was awesome to watch that yeah. on Christmas. Oh, yeah, it was a good yeah. Christmas present for everybody. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, were you nervous at all when it, when it, when it was going to drop and everything? Because, like, listen, besides the intro and all that, like, you had first part pretty much, you know? Yeah. So it's like, are you, like... We all know, bro. Yeah. First and last part. Mm -hmm. Come on. I, uh, everybody else is, you know, it's good. But the first part, it sets the tone. I was super kind of just nervous because I didn't necessarily know what was going to be in there. I just knew I had a lot of stuff. I didn't know the sequence. I didn't know what was going first. I just okay. oh, saw wow. asked him, just please, like, make this work. I really <laughs> <laughs> Straight up. So you had no, you, you had no idea. You didn't see like no, um we have like a little secret premiere like a really secret premiere and i seen it then it was like a couple of days before christmas mm -hmm. I, 
probably I tripped out. I, I teared up a little bit and I didn't know like, anything about the board or anything. I just knew wow. that this video just came out and I got first part in and I told Jolly then I was like, bro, I, I don't know if I was, if I even see myself having first or last part in anything like that's so like I thanked him like a bunch. I was just like, bro, thank you for because that's a position that Jolly's able to dictate as the yep. as the mastermind behind it. Exactly. Yeah, I mean, man. I don't know it must have been a humbling experience in that sense of just being like, damn, you put me right here. Like, really? <laughs> you know, for, for you, real. Like, so you guys didn't have like a premiere for it in any way other than that, huh? No, thirty cars. Stay inside the car. Mm. Get out, mask, like don't interact, watch the video. If too many people are walking around and stuff, like they would have shut it all down. Okay. Damn. Yeah. Wow. Dude, if that was a premiere in the regular the, the oh regular days, that would have been the most packed, hyped up video. Oh bro. Yeah, I, they would have shut it down. I, Shit would have been lit. Shut it down. <laughs> Fire Marshal Bill would have come <laughs> running through, bro. Like Dude. you guys gotta go. You thought the Baker premiere was crazy. Yeah, <laughs> Even when that cherry premiere, like that shit was crazy. I mm, thought oh, that yeah. something happened crazy at that premiere. So, I mean, it could have been one of those as well. So, mm-hmm. yeah. but how does it feel now, man? I mean, the board's been out for a little while. Like, how, 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 <laughs> you, how you, how you living right now, bro? Dude, good. Um, I just moved into a new spot recently with one of my friends. Okay. Um, skating's good. I feel good. I'm mad happy. Just uh, real peaceful, like, blessed state of mind. I'm yeah. working on stuff. Um, it's kind of just coming into place. Love it. I just want to take it as it comes day by day and just kind of approach it just like kind of calm and gracefully because I, you know, it's supposed to be like a long time thing. So I'm just want to, I'm, I'm here for the ride. You know, I've been here for it. So I just kind of take it as it comes. You got that, you got that, that spirit that I admire, Kevin, really. I mean, that's why I think we really, you know, have that little energy. I really am so stoked for you right now in this moment, man. Real shit. You know what I'm saying? (laughs) For real. That mm-hmm. that and I know it because it shines through. You know what I'm saying? Even when you you speak about skateboarding, bro, it's like so genuine to the point like everybody fucks with you in the industry. I already know that. Yeah. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? It, it's you, you, it speaks volume. So you know, big ups to you, man. Real yeah. shit on, on where you're at and where you're going. And no bullshit, man. You seem very zen right now. Like. On some, on some real shit, yeah. like you, you on the path. You know what you want to do. You know what has to be done. And you know how to take it step by step. And I think that's the most important thing. And that's something that a lot of people can look to you for right now as well, mm-hmm. because so many we've talked about it on the show. So many people can get in their own way when it comes to doing things in the industry and not going that right path. And I feel like you're someone who can lead by example. Yeah, honestly, I am pretty in a zen situation. <laughs> that's like just chilling because. My favorite skaters just be chilling. <laughs> Hell yeah. They do what they do when they do it and they try not to take it too serious. Although like that takes over sometimes and you can get a little overly passionate and you could even get over it or you could just want to hang out and not skate. Like that's all fine. But like the task at hand is to skate. Yeah. What what I've been doing has been skating. Mm-hmm. You no, know, like without the board, like I'd still be skating. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So it's like, all you have to do is skate and at the at the level it's at, the only other thing you have to do is get it on camera, mm-hmm. photo, photo on film, and hang out with your friends and just keep it as chill as possible. Because when you start thinking about it too much, then you're like, I don't want to skate, I don't want to be around these people, I don't want to go shoot a photo, I have to go try a hard ass trick that I don't want to do. I'm scared to get hurt. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh, it's so true. No, I, I know like stuff like that's gotten into my head through the years. You know, you you see, you know, you. You get on girl or chocolate, you know, especially back then, and you're kind of put on this pedestal, you know, and everybody knows who you are, like immediately, you know, and you're at the skate park and you need to, you know, you start thinking. Oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, I definitely sure. went through my fair share of that shit. Yeah. That's for damn sure. But now you are in the same kind of position, you know, on Illegal Civ and this video that came out and like, like if, if people didn't know you before, they damn sure as well know you now. <laughs> You know what I mean? Like, oh yeah, kind of crazy, but I don't know. Like the thing is with that, like, it's just still like, I can't let that do anything right. to me. Crazy. That would like disrupt my, my peace and my balance. Mm-hmm. So it's like, I do the same shit that I've always done. Like if I go to the skate park. I just go and hang out. If I feel like, you know, sitting there for a while and I'll sit there and just watch people skate. If I want to just skate flat or kick my board around, so be it. But then if I want to like get into it and start doing my thing, then it's like, it's there and I'll, I'll 
get sweaty and do what I got to do. Well, like when you go out and film, like, um, do you have like, do you get in, like, do you get in your own head or do you just kind of let the trick come to you? Because sometimes I know that like when you, you know, when you film and stuff, like it could be so far away, you know, and then you start thinking about it, thinking about, it, you know, it's like, <laughs> All the things start happening and you're tripping out and people walking by. Well, that's what I'm saying. Like, like, like <laughs> take for instance, like when you did that trick and you went right inside and got a beer, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I felt like that was like, oh my, like probably so many th that probably took in my own eyes. I'm like, that probably took so fucking long or like you were trying, you were dealing with so much bad. shit and you just said, I'm going to get a beer. It depends. Cause sometimes I can stay like mad chill and real peaceful. But if I'm trying something a little bit harder and I've never done it, I'll get upset because I know I can do it. I pictured it in my head and mm -hmm. it's not, mm -hmm. or like if I know how to do it and I've done it before and it's not working, that'll also make me really upset. But I, I just try not to freak out too much, but with the, um, the switch to Vario Hill, it was kind of early in the day. We were in, um, we we're in Spain, a little bit outside of Spain. I mean, uh, outside of Barcelona and we're just, skating the spot and I figured out the trick and it just kind of happened within like 30 minutes. But I remember I went in the, in the bar to get like a bottle of water or something. Mm. I seen that the tap was cold and all that. So like, <laughs> that was your, that was your little motivation. <laughs> Most of those sessions, like in bar scene and stuff, like you guys know, like you'll just go to the store and there's a pack of brews sitting around and you'll, you're doing your thing. But that one, it just felt good to go and get it out like the nice glass. and everything. <laughs> so sick. Straight, uh, That's the reward right there. And it's funny because we, I think even Kelly commented like, dude, sweaty ass dude going into the oh, bar yeah. to, get a, to get a, you know, it, but it's so, that's Barcelona though, yeah. right? You're just, you could go <laughs> in. And, <laughs> it, is what, it is what it is. Sweaty ass dude walks in, like give you a beer. You're yeah, like, yeah. All right. Dude. Did you see me out there, bro? Working, Working man. Straight up. Nah, man. man. 11.30 a.m., went in there, ordered it in Spanish. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. That's right. Yes. Hey, I got a quick question. What was the last trick you filmed for your part? Like, and when was that? I think the last trick was that line, the Wally 180, and then the switch nose around fakie flip. Okay. Mm. It was a couple days before the premiere. I was trying some other stuff, and I tried tricks until literally the day before the premiere. Oh, wow. Damn. Yeah, sometimes they don't, they're like, no, we're done. No more, no more footage. But it's cool no. you got to, like, get right before the day. Oh, I saw a yeah. clip in those uh those Adidas that the, the Thrasher oh, Adidas, and I was like, oh, he yeah. just got that. I just we just got those. <laughs> <laughs> Jolly Jolly held it down and just kind of let me try like my hardest because I was stressing a bit too. I didn't know what was gonna be my last trick, and mm. what I wanted to be the last trick didn't end up working out. So we just kept skating, and then my friend Andrew Freeman kind of came into the mix too, just towards the end of the video. And him and I filmed a part when I was like 16. It's called Disorganized Fun with like Louie and Mason and all that. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. We were just talking about that the other day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That was me really well. So we were able to go out and like try a bunch of stuff and try for hours and hours. And it just it didn't work out. But he filmed that. And that one was like near and dear because it was like a week till the premiere. It's like my day one friend that came back around. So we could like we're filming and shit again, like yeah. the energy. And it, it didn't work out last trip wise, but that was the last thing I, that we did. Did you have a choice in the song too? Yeah. Okay. Uh, That's good. That's yeah. good. I put it on my own and sent it to Jolly. Mm. Dope. Dope. And then he yeah. just worked around that. Yeah. I'd love that. No, I love that so too. Good. At least you're able to like have some part besides just the skateboarding involvement. You know what I'm saying? like. But at the yeah. same time, he's so talented that you probably don't even need to. Yeah, of course. Of course. You could trust him. Yeah. You, just right. wanna, you just wanna have a little piece yeah. besides the skateboarding, For you know, sure. like in yeah. there, you know? It's huge, this song. And the song too. is a monumental it's totally, fucking, huge. you know. Totally. And I will say this, Kevin, man, you guys and your crew, it it's so rad to see. Yeah. It's so rad to see everybody with each other and you know because that's what like a video is all about that's what makes people want to be a part of that yep. you know and maybe that's why the video is so successful is just because like you see that camaraderie you see uh, that, that everybody's just chilling having a great time it's what makes it more of a, a movement than a team there yep. you go you know what i'm saying like just the ill civ is like that is y'all whether it was packaged up and put on the boards or done the way it is i feel like that's just y'all all day every day and it's just being shared with the world now through this board brand. Yeah, yeah. fact, because that, that's what we've been doing, you know, before the boards, we 
go skate together, go lurk spots. We were making videos. Like if you look at Mikey's history of videos on his um, YouTube account, they go back like 10 years. Yeah. I, mean. wow. I remember him giving me a video like real shit, probably like eight years ago, maybe nine years ago on the block. And like, man, you should check this video out, man. He's got a bunch of young, like talented kids. And unbehold, it was you guys, obviously, but I didn't know at the, at the time. So I was just like, damn, okay. You know, and I still got that shit. I wow. tripped out on it. And just to see how far you have, you guys have come, I'm like, man, you know, and like I see, I used to see you guys run up on the block a lot, you know, especially when I was up there quite a bit. So it was like, it's pretty amazing to see how far you guys have come, man. Real well, shit. also Mikey, he would have these premieres in like the, a cul-de-sac right. and like just on the street right. and shit. It's like so sick, <laughs> so right? Sick. Yeah. That was the one you got. You remember that? Did you come to that? Well, I got a funny story about that. I'm not gonna, you know, I'm just gonna you say save that. Well, no, because Mikey Alfred, he he actually told me about it because I I don't I you know I didn't. Remember oh, when it, he was but, on. Yeah, he okay. actually sent emails to like a bunch of pros, like everybody. And he told me that I was the only one that responded to his email and said, "Hey, man, I, I don't think I can make it." But, you know, big ups, congrats wow. and everything. That's and like, dope. he was like, he took that to heart. He was like, man, you're the only one. You're that's the only one sick. that responded to my email. <laughs> Amazing. That's, that's so sick. sick. That's wow. crazy. You don't even respond to my texts when I... Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can you blame me, Kevin? Come on. <laughs> no, but respond to the emails that long ago. Like, get them, yeah. get them. Right? <laughs> No, I've just been a big fan ever. You know what I mean? Like you guys have just held it down and it's just cool, man. It's just cool. It's like, like Steve said, it's like a movement, you know, it is, it's like when sure. shorties came out with the, their, you know, the horses and, you know, I always go back to that because it just <laughs> makes me, <laughs> dude, it makes me want to be a part of it. Yes. That's all I'm saying. I, I, I'm looking right at you and the horse is literally right behind you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> no, but I get what you're saying though, because it made me wish that I was like 10 years younger and I could just kind of run with that crew. You know what I'm totally, saying? Like yeah. It just it puts you in that mindset mm -hmm. of like, I that's the crew. Like you, all, we all had our like crews growing up, and like mm -hmm. we all wanted to hang out and skate together. We did everything together, and like we had the Dunn crew back in the day and all that. But like this illegal civilization is like that's the movement right now for this generation, and it's. Yeah. I'm jealous that I'm fucking, I'm an old head now. I know. <laughs> I know. How can we, we be down, man? How can we be down? Well, let, let's ask you this, and since we're on that, well, how did you even get on Illegal Civ? I mean, were you just, was it just uh, boys with everybody, or? I mean, I was already skating with Mikey. I see two, it came out already. Um, Knock, Kevin, TJ, Sage, Sean, Aiden are all on FA and hockey, but we're still skating. Um, just kind of doing our thing. I was getting boards from Five Borough first. Mm. Oh, okay. Boards from Five Borough for like three years or something, just like on a full program. And when Kevin and Knock turned pro around then, that's when Riches was working for FA. Mm -hmm. so Riches would hook me up with boards because um, Five Borough wouldn't always be able to like send boards or they'd send the wrong size sometimes, whatever difficulties. Mm-hmm. And I started skating FA boards for a little bit, <clears throat> but then Mikey brought up like, "I want to, I want to do ICS boards. We'll, we'll make it like a thing. Get you paid X, Y, and Z. Like, are you down?" I'm like, "Yeah, for sure." But then, I remember Kevin Bradley and I used to live together, and he walks in the living room one night. He's like, "Do you want to skate for FA? Yes or no?" And he's on the phone. Oh God! <laughs> and I'm like, uh. I, I just told you, like, what's going on with Mikey? Like, I, <laughs> I can't. And then, like, the next day or something, I'm on the block, and Dill came up to me. He's like, yo, what up? Like, they, they told me what's going on. Congratulations. Like, you know, like, I, I think they told him yes anyway, just trying to, like, look out for me and get me in a good spot. So he's like, yeah, you know, like, it'll all work itself out. Like, we'll, we'll, we'll get it sorted. But you're on, you know, congratulations. And I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, shit. I was like spooked kind of, I was just like, bro, wait, 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 wait. But then I, I went to his house and then we were just talking and just told him like, I know you know how it feels to want to be in a position with all your friends, but you you want to hold your, your other friend down. You want to hold your good friend down also. You want to be where he is to help him build something. Mm -hmm. Yeah. When I left, when I left Dill's house that day, I just was like, all right, let's we're we're all in, and that was already like five years ago. Damn, that's Damn. amazing! Wow. Bro. 
I bet Dill respected that too, man. Hell for yeah. sure. That's my dog. And he, he responded like super cool about it too. He's like, yo, like this is like, cause you're our people, like your fam, like, you know, like that's what it is. And that's what it's always going to be because I do feel you in that. I do know what's going on. I even brought up, I was like, so like when you were skating for Etnies or when you were skating for Vita or, or stuff like that, I gave him like some references because Dill is somebody that I've watched, you know, like I started skating in 98. So I seen photosynthesis, I seen skate more, I mean, yeah, skate more. I seen all that stuff then I've been aware of it. So I was able to kind of just be like, bro, like, well, what about when this happened and when this happened and <laughs> gave me insight more than like, told me what to do or anything you know we just kind of shared stories for a bit and just talked and when you have when you pay attention like that that's when you can refer back to things and, and then you could kind of like there's be like, no oh, question bro, what about when you were in this state you know what yeah. I'm saying? like what did you feel or how would you you know when you made your next move you know that's kevin bro that's what i'm saying man that's why i got a lot of respect for you bro you pay attention and you know you 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 love skateboarding, you man. Grounded and you love, like, I let's love say, it all boils down to the skateboarding. Yeah. You know? So you do your archive and you do your history and, you know, here we go. And here we are. Hit and deal with those examples, man. Yeah. I love it, bro. I, lo- yeah. it. I totally <laughs> forgot that Dill wrote for Etnies back then. And mm-hmm. you remember see that photo of Sheckler and him back in the day? Oh. There's a photo of Dill no and Sheckler way. together. I was like, that is the, like, very odd couple right there but oh, man oh yeah good times that's tough you know it's uh, that's a that's a huge that's a huge decision you know if you think about it man those are my bros you know that's my yeah. family like, yeah. kevin everybody over there is my family and mikey and everybody that's my family mm-hmm. and you know, like when dill stepped in and was saying that's like he's just trying to look out for me based on what my family told him right mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So it's like it just went how it went because I wanted to hold down my family on this end. Yeah, and, yeah. You know, I, I appreciate and I look up to. So it's like I'm I'm glad that it worked out like that. Dude, absolutely, man. And and you just you know being skate like for for example, I think Zach he was getting boards from girl. You know, mm-hmm. he was, he was on yeah. flow. Kevin smiles. He was on, <laughs> he was on flow for girl. And, um, and then he went to illegal Civ. I don't know what happened there or anything, but you know what though? Like, that, I, but that was Kev. He made that, <laughs> he, he made, he made that decision. For uh, Kev, uh, we got I had a, a discussion with Kevin about this. That's really funny. Yeah. Well, we got to go, man. <laughs> uh, it's been great. Thank you so much. No, but, but that's what I love though. I love that, you know, listen he made the decision to go but he's with his boys you know what i mean yeah. like if he got yeah. on girl i don't know that he knows anybody over there you know and he'd be kind of this dude this getting in the van and you know what i mean like it just makes when something makes sense yeah, well, it's more natural yeah it makes sense yeah. you know and then that that's when i'm like okay that's cool i'm stoked for him you yeah. know like elijah burl in the in the fa thing you know literally with zach like i've sat down at I remember we were at a damn am in Chicago. Like I was hanging out with Zach while he was on girl two. Mm-hmm. I remember we were at a damn am in Chicago and I'm at the table eating with him and his mom and we're all chatting. And I told him, I'm just like, bro, like you should like come around and like skate with us a little bit more. It'd be tight if you skated for I see this and this. And he came with us to Australia on girl, you know, mm. I think that kind of just set the tone. Cause it's just like, bro, like we can keep doing this. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I mean, like same with Aramis. We went to Barcelona when he was on chocolate. Mm-hmm. And I remember, I think we were in Jamboree or something, or we were turning. <laughs> I'm like, bro, we can keep doing this. In Jamboree. Jamboree. God damn. I remember that place. Yeah. Yeah. We've, all, we've all had those conversations. Yeah. Yeah. Old Jamboree. Let me guess. You, you, you came out of there, it was daylight. Yeah. Yeah. And you went skating. Yeah. We can yeah. keep doing this. Yeah. Keep doing <laughs> Let's just keep doing this, man. Up. It's so oh. funny you bring up Girl too because this is also like very reminiscent of how Girl kind of became mm. what no, it was. No, it was all based you know? off friendship and like, you know, yeah. people just wanting to stick together in that loyalty foundation. So, yeah, man, this is that's why I'm like, damn, I mean, I, I definitely can kind of vibe to what, towards what you guys are doing, especially from my standpoint, because that's how, it, you know, it felt to me. And that's how it's feeling. That energy over there is kind of like replicating the same thing. Midler came about kind of the same way. He's been the homie forever. Like right? That's our bro. I skated Castle with Midler when he was orange helmet eight years old and just he just has been around and I, he was in the first i see video promo ever mm. you know what i mean and then when he's on sovereign and he's doing his thing he's still hanging out with us like 
Miller and I have hung out in Copenhagen together what, like a few years ago. And he's just always been the bro. So he started coming around and I brought it up to everyone too. I was like, what do you guys think of like Alex? And it wasn't like a thing at first. And then Mikey brought it up around again. Mm. Like It like started to become a thing. He started coming around more and more and just skating and just doing what he does, you know, because Midler and Mikey are friends for a while because <clears throat> Midler's brother, Todd, and Mikey both film and they're around the same age also. You know, Todd and Alex would go hang out with Mikey and skate in North Hollywood and do all of that. So it's a connection from like way back that no one really seen. Right. Mm -hmm. Like us, because we're there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It sounds like you're kind of the recruiter over there. I know, man. You've been getting all the writers, all the pros (laughs) now. man. Listen, bro. He's the glue, keeping everybody together. Yeah. (laughs) It is this friendship. And when you see like your friends like in positions that, you see their potential or you just want to spend more time with them and you have a way to bring them closer, then like, why not do it? <clears throat> exactly. So, I have another friend, Sean, Sean Ives. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. I like that's the homie. And he was skating for Arbor for a while. Like he skates IC boards now. Sick. He came around skating. He came on trips and pardon Godspeed. You know what I mean? Amazing. Just, just you come around and skate because you're already the homie. It's going to naturally bit. happen. Yeah. And that's the way it should be done. I mean, anything yeah. can look good on paper, right? You could put together the best fucking team in skateboarding and it, may, it just may not work, mm-hmm. you know? And if it does, people can see right through that, you know? Yeah. They can see not It's been done. It's been tried. Yeah. They've tried that many a time. It does not work. <laughs> right. Sorry. Yeah, it'll work <clears throat> for a small period of time, but it'll yeah, right. ultimately implode. Exactly. Yeah. So I love what you guys are doing over there, man. It's it's great. I, it seems like you're the guy. Uh, if you need uh, any more work, we need to get guests in here. <laughs> seems like a good recruiter. Kelly, you're doing a great job, but still, man. Kevin I think would Kevin, do way better. I think you do a way better job. <laughs> just, I'm just throwing that out there. <laughs> just throwing that out there, man. No, but it's just rad to see, man. I'm so stoked on this board, bro, yeah, and man. everything, hey, man. Real Super quick, stoked. Real Jeez. quick question. What? What's the story behind this graphic? Like, who made, who drew this? Wheels made it, and Wheels is one of our day one homies. Mm. Wheels had a part in IC One. Wheels is one of the first people I met when I started skating with Mikey. Mm. Wheels is a cool artist, and he does a lot of our graphics. And Mikey and I were living together for a while last year, and Wheels would come over almost every day and just work on art. So Wheels was just really tapped in and just kind of knew what to do with with those boards. Yeah. It was all weird. Dude, I love that, man. It's like when one person eats, everybody eats. Yeah, yeah. Like you man. Tap in you with an artist? Oh, yeah, come on, come on. Yeah, you tap in with the <laughs> homies that have been around from the jump and, like, really make sure that everybody can find a, a pocket to kind of be in and you just fucking just run it up. I yeah. love that shit. And not to mention that you guys are literally the first pros, right, on yeah. Illegal Civ. That's insane yeah. to so me. So sick. Feels good. It's a blessing. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. What size board do you ride? A5. Eight you five. ride an eight five? Big dog. Big yeah. dog. Yeah. You were size you size fourteen too, right? Thirteen. Thirteen? Yeah. Fourteen's a little bit too much, dude. <laughs> well, <laughs> I ain't got much to say about that. <laughs> You're right. Here's a here's a hey, here's a good question. Cause a lot of I think a lot of like new pros have, have uh, a little bit of problem with this, bro. Do you ride your own board? Oh, uh so <laughs> Hell yeah. Well, <laughs> I, I, I ride my shit. I don't give a fuck about it. No, but you're not, new, you're not new pro. I, don't, I say ride your shit. If you don't, <laughs> yeah. if you, no, but you, a lot of people, you ain't marketing right. Remember John? Ride, ride your shit. John Delo, he's like, I don't know if I could ride my own, but a lot of people have pro- problems. I, I had that problem. I didn't right away. I waited because the day they gave me my board, I put a new complete on. I didn't know what was going on. I just wanted to set up a new complete. It's the day after Christmas. <laughs> yeah. I put a new complete on. And then they gave me my board and I was like, well, I'm not taking this off. Like skate the board I got. So I skated like two or three boards before that, but my boards don't last that long. Right. So I got on one of mine, like in the, like within two weeks and a half weeks. Real. How did, cause I saw, when I saw the photos of you guys turning pro, oh, I got so happy, dude. I'm not, I'm seriously was so happy. And I looked at you immediately and I was like, I felt it, dude. I was like, yes, dude. Oh, yeah. That feeling, and I, I want to know how, A, I must have felt great, but like, how do they surprise you? Dude, so we do vlogs, 
and it's like a mandatory thing that we do. Like we we always go and just film some stuff and go discover or explore, or just do stuff together. Mm -hmm. But sometimes it's just like time consuming and you rather spend your time skating or doing something else. So they said, okay, link up on, it was supposed to be December 31st. So my anniversary with my girlfriend is New Year's Day. Mm. San Francisco. So that wasn't going to work out. And I told them that. <clears throat> so they changed it. So link up the day after Christmas. Don't know what's going on or anything. Just meet up here at the Topanga Canyon. Mm. I was still in transition with staying at spot. So I go from Sean Imes' house to Topanga Canyon. We all go hang out. We're just like drinking champagne on the beach, chilling, watching dolphins, like just like on a vibe, honestly. Mm. Didn't really know what was going on. Just like, we're going to go meet up. Let's just be in this area. So we go meet up and then we start walking up this trail. We're just like, where are we going? Where are we going? And Alex says to me mid walk, he's like, bro, if they don't meet us at the top of this fucking hill with your board, this is bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> he had no idea either. None okay. of us had a clue except like Jolly and Gary. Right. Wow. Lives in the bay. So he had to drive down and it was like a reason for him to drive down. But um, I'm like, well, don't hold your breath. Like, we're probably just doing some regular shit. So we go up into, like, where some trees are and a little bit of the canyon. And Mikey just pops out. He's like, yo, what up? <laughs> you know, he's just like, how y'all feeling? You know, Godspeed came out yesterday. Like, he's doing good. Hands Jolly a bottle of champagne. And he's like, congratulations. Everyone's like patting Jolly. Like, congrats, Jolly. Woo woo. And I think someone else asked, like, yo, are we at the top? He's like, no, we're not at the top. Keep walking. So we start going up the trail more. And I'm at the back of the line. And Mikey's like, Kevin, come up here. So I walk up a little bit more. And he pulls a board from behind his back. And it's just like the yellow top of the front. I don't even see my name on it. And I don't know, like, I wasn't discouraged. But I'm just like, man, like, I'm tired and stoned. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to even do all this. I'm just like looking at the board thinking it's like a Godspeed board or something. And I turn around and it's mine. I just looked for him and I just like laughed. Like, <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I took it in and I just like kind of broke down. So yeah. sad. Yeah. Yeah. It was captured, man. Hard work pays off. Hell it, yeah. Bro. Also, I, real quick though, I love that you said those vlogs are mandatory because that right there, that team building, that bonding I, shit I, is like. You don't, I don't know, man. I think like the, the kids nowadays, like vlogs and all that shit are just like what people tune into. Motherfuckers don't watch TV and all that shit. Mm -hmm. So for that to be something that's kind of like, obviously not written in your contract, but like something y'all do yeah. on a consistent basis to keep the content going. Mm -hmm. It's fucking beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Mandatory. If you got shit to do. Right. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Drone, we're going to go vlog after this, bro. Let's get you it good? done. You good? You're ready. <laughs> yeah. You ready. Okay. Hey, Chris, people have been Making asking sure. for I'm glad I'm not me. Man, it is so. Tim, you heard that? Anyway. <laughs> there. No. Anyway, this isn't about it. This is about Kevin, dude. Okay, Congratulations, man. bro. Seriously, well deserved. We are man, so stoked so for sick. you. Yeah, and man, man. I want to tell you too that personally, we don't have guests in the studio yet. But when we do have guests back, you're going to be one of the first people to come in here, bro, because we want to sit down and get a whole nine club with you if yeah, you're man. if you're down. Let's do it. Let's get it, bro. Yes, because mm -hmm. this is not. We want to. We want to dive in. Yeah, to, to Kevin. Dude, Mike. it's been so long since Definitely. we've done bro, that. About a year dude. almost. Oh my gosh, crazy, bro. That's weird to think. It's coming soon. And we haven't done one with Jerron yet. Oh no. yeah, it's mm -hmm. gonna be. Good. Oh, you, you nervous? Yeah, a little bit. Okay. <laughs> 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 no, man, I'm looking forward to this. I'm definitely interested to to meet and, and greet whoever sits down in that chair. Well, bro. Kevin's gonna be one of them. There yeah. we go. There we go. Hey, what are you gonna do right now, man? What are you gonna go? You gonna go get some sushi? <laughs> what, what's going on right now? Have some dinner soon. Okay. I would just have maybe a glass of wine or something. Oh, yeah. there you go. Like it. Red or white? I want to say red, depending on what she got, but red. Yeah, mm, yeah. yeah. It's nighttime. You gotta have red. Yeah, yeah. the reds. Mm -hmm. are the red. yeah. I don't know. I'm not a big white fan. If you're eating fish, oh, you know, maybe a little fish. white. Knows. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. yeah. But yeah. usually you do that like early afternoon, evening, and into the night you go to the red. Is Absolutely. white wine not for late night? Nah. No, mm -mm. it's a daytime thing, more or less. Yeah, <laughs> yeah like rose. You know, I'm not gonna drink rose at, at night. night. Yeah. Right, right. 
I have some friends that do confirmed it's red. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey, yes. Cheers, my man. Cheers, hey, Dave. Dave. Cheers. My man. Uh, you are the Gabe. man, bro. Straight up. What's that? What you got, Pino? Mm-hmm. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Bro, yes. I, mean, I, didn't got, I didn't got a little sophisticated during the quarantine. Mm-hmm. You feel me? <laughs> <laughs> Any questions? Uh, LD's a Somalia. LD is. <laughs> a Somalia, bro. You can you look like he, he's got it. He looks okay. like you're doing good. <laughs> But seriously, dude, hey, congratulations, bro. Yes. Uh, tell Mikey also that we're uh, we're super psyched. And um, super psyched, man, we miss all you guys and uh, want to have you on the show, bro. I'm around. I'll see you guys around. Miss you guys. Let's go, bro. Yeah, man. Come, come skate with us. All right. You skate little curbs? <laughs> yeah. Bro, I'm from Los Angeles. You got that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, where'd you grow up? I'm from South Central. I was born in Inglewood. I grew up in both. Yeah. I was born in Inglewood too. Which hospital? Sentinella. Oh. Okay. I was born in Neil Freeman, huh? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> He I called just, it out. He did. He did. <laughs> went to school like right next door to Daniel Freeman. Oh, really? Yeah, at the St. John's. That's where old C-Rob was born, man. Inglewood. Love it. Love it. Yeah, yeah Chris is a baby. Can tell. That's why we they call me Inglewood Roberts, bro. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> oh, yeah. What was that with Shane? <laughs> yeah, Shane Hyle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shane Hyle. Yeah. Slow down. Slow down. <laughs> hey, dude. Thank you so much for stopping by, bro. And again, seriously, big congrats uh, Definitely big to, you congrats, and the, man. to you and Zach and uh, go, Alex, man. Go buy his board, everyone. Yeah. 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 Now. Bro, Run sold out. out the first day. It's coming back up. Oh, re-up. Re- yeah. re- re- what is it? The first Friday of February? As it should be. There you go. Oh, Perfect That's timing. in two days from, well, from time of filming, or time this airs, it'll be in two days. Perfect. Perfect. Yep. Make sure these sell out again. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you guys. I appreciate it. That's love, guys. Hey, go enjoy your dinner. Go enjoy your little glass of wine with your uh, with your lady. And uh, dude, again, thank you so much, Kevin. Bro, yeah, congrats. Bro. Congratulations. Yeah, Kev. Man. Thank you, big. We'll dog. see you soon, man. Yeah, Kevin White. Bro. There, Kev. There you go, bro. Kevin White, bro. New Great guy. Yeah. The bro? best, dude. Fuck the yeah. best. He is the best. He best. Yeah. So zen. Like, he, like I meant that when I said, like, he just, his whole time, he was just cool, calm, and yeah. collected. Oh, he was. Definitely. Yeah. And that was, like, before his wine. Right? Yeah. <laughs> wow. He's just that guy. I love him. He's that he's, guy. He's, ever since the first time I've met him, the first, every time, he's just, he's always just been, it's like, when I first met him, it's like I knew him mm-hmm. already. Yeah. He has yeah. that. It's like, he has that yeah. vibe. Right? Yeah, totally. Right. It's like, have I known you for yeah. 10 years? Right. Yeah. But I just met you. Yeah, yeah. I, I had the same thing. First met him, you're like, wait, I have, have I known you for so Seriously? long? I'm not even no, kidding. No, like, no. it really comes across yeah. that way. He has that yeah. vibe. Yeah. yeah. So, no, he is, such that, a, he is that energy in, 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 in the skateboard industry. I, I, I believe that he resonates that little energy towards everybody. Yeah. yeah it's mm-hmm. the same. It's very, like, yeah. even keeled. They ain't changing. It's, Cause it's that's why it's infectious. It's so, like, yeah. He's an old soul. Oh, old soul. Yeah. That makes sense. It's authentic. Yeah. Yeah. He's not. He does, there's no facade. He's not putting on a show to pro, to project as though he's he's just that. It's yeah. just him. He's yeah, not trying you know? to be some like be cool and yeah. funny yeah. people and yeah. shit like that. Absolutely. Like, he's just he's just him. And like I said, it's infectious. So yeah, yeah. 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 So hey, shout out Kevin White. Shout Straight out up. Illegal Civ, Mikey uh, Mikey Alfred, and uh, Devonte Jolly, and everybody else that was involved. Yeah. We're gonna next week. We should have the uh, Zach Sarcino and. Alex Midler boards to go yeah, along with man. this. So that's what we have right Ow. now. Hell yeah. So good. Yeah. Let me tell you, man. I'll tell you a, li- a little bit later. Huh? Mm, okay. I'll tell you a little bit later. I like your okay. style. I'll tell secrets. you a little bit later. I like it. The yes. cliffhangers. Now wow. I'm, I'm, now I'm, wanna, yeah, I'm wondering. I want to like, can we fast forward in the show? Yeah. Yeah. Like, no, don't sticking. fast forward. <laughs> don't fast forward. He bro. ain't sticking the script right now. But we do have timestamps in the description. So if you are watching, you could just pop, 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 you know, pop, 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 I want to go here. I want to go here. I want to go here. Pop. Um, but I will say this though, because we, man, listen, so I don't know how many times people fucking leave a comment or DM or email something, get more shirts in, get more product, get your, your website is empty. Yeah, it's true. Our website's empty. It happens. But not now. Okay. What? We have shirts, we have mugs, we have boards, we have all kinds of stuff. Bro. So much. We're we re-upped. Yeah, bro, mugs. Look at this. 
We got mug, we switch flip Manny mug. Oh. Correspond. We got mugs. We got mugs in the shop. Fur days. We got shirts. Huh? 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 Yeah. We got <laughs> Switch Flip nice Manny bags. shirts. Those bags are nice, dude. Great bags. The Great bags. bags. Little poly yeah. bag. You yeah. like that little poly bag? Yeah. Fresh. We dog. got we got shirts. <laughs> we got shirts. And we got shirts, bro. Well, how many how many shirts. different kinds of shirts do we have? Three. Three different kinds? Yeah. What kind of shirts? They're uh black. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what do you mean what kind of shirts? The logo. The, the oh, graphics. The Switch Flip Manny, of yeah. course. Yeah. Everybody yeah. loves it. Everybody loves it. <laughs> We got the pocket. It's not a pocket, but it's a pocket logo. Okay. You know, the yeah. pocket guy, and then we went the back print. You Ooh. know the, the circle back print logo. Double up on them. And the bar logo. You know what I'm saying? Good logos. Yeah, we've got mm -hmm. the bar logo. I like that. Yeah. These That's are all. all. Oh. Oh, go ahead, please. Oh no, no it's no. not all. So I don't. My question might be answered. Hold your thought. <laughs> yeah. Hold your thought. Uh, we also have signed mm. Justin Eldridge board. I don't even nice. know. That. Look at that. <laughs> Sign Justin Eldridge board. Yo, uh, Tim brought it up earlier. That is a beautiful ass Hell signature. Yeah, that Thank you, Jesus, bro. Is... I've been <laughs> doing this for years. Uh, signed craw board, huh? I Look like that. that blue. Oh, blue. I like blue. You know what's tight? I was looking uh, at those. Very blue. It's like a little, it's like a, the print on it's super cool, actually. Like, it's like risen a little bit. Like it's, it's, it's raised. raised. It's raised. Yeah, it's risen. Deep. And a dubs. We got a dubs board. Dubber. Signed dubs board on the site Made too. Made in the shop. These Let's are these go. are limited. These are very limited quantity. So you want to get there quick. Get there while you yeah, can. We don't that, got a lot of them. We don't got a lot. That W purple haze. Look at that, mm. bro. Mm. Look at that. Smoke session. Your hoodie matches that right now. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. I was wow. trying to. I didn't know we were going to talk about this. But <laughs> 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 next week. Oh. We'll take that. And that's it. that's it for now, man. How random is that? I was actually going to wear the, the, the apparel, but I, I, like oh. I said, I should have checked. <laughs> I don't want to do too much. Yeah. yeah three's a good number. Three's a good, great number. That's what. That's all we got. Yeah, that's good. Wait. What about. Do you have wait. any shirts or anything? We got shirts. <laughs> you didn't Amazing. See? Oh, yeah. Shirts. Wait, wait, shirts, wait, wait, wait. What about Big Dog Kelly? Oh, okay. <laughs> Just for Ryan Gallant, huh? Just, <laughs> just that's the Ryan. only reason yeah. why he did it. Right. That's why I we got signed <laughs> Kelly Hart boards up hey. on the site. Yes. Yeah. 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 Not only wait. Now listen, we got, because we had to split the graphics. We had to split them. So we got uh, two oh. different graphics. Also, but they're both limited quantities. So, so sick. Yeah. So there you go, man. We got Crob, LD, Dubs. And K Fatty. Yeah. <laughs> I love that, K Fatty. I'm going to stick with that one. Go yeah. with that. K Fatty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, works out. I think Jerry Sue gave me that name. For okay. Sure, right? Did he? Yeah, yeah, on the show. Amazing. Call me K Dude, Fatty. Oh, Tinkerbell Kale. I thought that's what, uh, when you were in skate camp or something. I could have sworn he just made. I told the story I was at skate camp and I sneezed and I was all fat and I pulled yeah, my back he out. Was like, I, <laughs> I was like, oh, K <"Okay>, Fatty. <laughs> I could have sworn that's, it was different. But, so maybe. we got, those are all on the site. So go check them out. Boards are limited. Signed boards are limited quantity, but uh, shirts and all that stuff. And we're going to be uh, sweatshirts soon. Yeah, uh, sweatshirts, sweatshirts and yep. um, mugs. Crew necks. Crew necks. Mm -hmm. That was my necks. question. Mm -hmm. You that just it. answered it. Yep. There you go. Hoodies bro. and crews. Hoodies and crews coming soon, maybe in the next couple of days. I or say in no the later than week. Wednesday, Thursday. There you go. Damn. There you go. So go stock up, man. Nine club dot, the nine club dot com mm. is the website. Can we get a little uh, box? Like a our monthly box? Well, I'll give you a discount code. <laughs> <for the website. laughs> I'll give you plus 20%. <laughs> I'm going to add some add more. Add 20. Yeah. Yeah. Just, just for you. I actually enter that code to pay more. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good idea. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what does he think this is, bro? No, unbelievable. Or I could just pay for it just a normal price. No, no, no. Yeah. Avoid that. Yeah. I'm gonna avoid um, 20%. Yeah. Shit. <laughs> Shit. By the way, man. Shit. I totally spaced it on this. You know what? You know what? I'll tell you guys later. Are you doing this again? I'm doing it again. Wow. You right. did it twice. You, doing it twice. Again. So, you gotta give up. us the first yeah, give one. Give us the now. first one, or that's it. Or that. And then you can get the And then you can do the other one later. Yeah. You gotta like fill it's in. It's a give and take here, Chris. Yeah. There's only one of those allowed per It's episode. balance. We got to balance it out. Yeah. He's trying to hold okay. two things. You know right what it now. is then? <laughs> Not only did they turn pro, man, Kevin White, Alex Miller, Zach Cercino, there was another pro, mm -hmm. another new pro on the scene, man. 
JP Souza hey, turned what? pro for visual skateboards, bro. That's a oh, sick yeah. JP stopped by uh, with uh, Joey Brzezinski, the te his team manager and teammate. So we got two. We got two JP Souza boards. My guy. My guy. That yeah. will be included in this in this raffle for the illegal sieve boards. Boom. So let me get this straight. If three people win, how many boards they get? You're gonna get five. Woo damn! Five boards. How? What? That's How? like a that's a box. That's right a box. There. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That's, that's a, a legit box. If you're sponsored, like you are getting a legit box showing up to your house from yep. the nine club. From and the nine club. Let's and go. And visual. And visual. Hey, yeah. Congratulations, JP Souza. Yeah. For turning pro for visual skateboards. Yes. Amazing. Man. Go check them out. Uh, Visualskateboards.com. Well go, deserved. Go check out yeah. uh, up on that. It's Illegal really Civ also. Uh, Illegalsiv.com is their website also. And JP just came just out with the, the part. just drop some shit, man. Banger so, part, dude. Yeah. Got this right here. Big day's a special day, man. I'm stoked. I have to go around the back. It'll be seen when they're ready. Yeah, so you know when the break is bored. I changed the grip day. This guy was being a dick and breaking boards. So I had to come by oh, and give you some new boards. Oh, hey. like oh, man. Yeah. <laughs> So sick. Wow. Super Amazing, bro. Congratulations, JP. Yeah, Sosa, congrats, bro. Hell yeah. So and, uh, cool. He did come out with a new part, bro. Oh, I try to do any of the tricks he does. Like, he is good, bro. Damn. I front shove a crook like that is such Man. a gangster trick. Hella pinch, too. Yeah. yeah, he's on that shit. The little toe wiggle for a sec. Uh -huh. and he's chilled. Little wiggle. Chill. <laughs> Little, flick, little, wiggle little, little wiggle, wiggle chill. chill. Sometimes I'm not a fan of the wiggle, but you know that one worked. It was a chill wig. Oh, no slide. <laughs> chill, chill wig. Chill, chill wig. wig. That was jacked. No slide fakey. Yeah, he, he whipped that shit around. Bro, no push switch 50360. Ooh, he snapped out of that. Hella. Damn. Ooh wee. The boy's good. Yeah, man. all the way around. Not no bullshit tick. -tack. Right, he pushed it to the limit. Oh my god. How do you? He's good. Snap that's how. That's, that's exactly how. No, that's we're heel crook. <laughs> fucking perfect. Oh god. Yeah, how that's such like a the 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 bench or the bank to bench is such like a OG. Oh yeah. Obstacle to skate. Yeah. So yeah. sick, dude. Where is this one? I've never seen this spot. Uh, I've been seeing people skate it a lot. I, I don't yeah. know where it's, it's in at. a bully free zone. Yep. Uh, I love it. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It ain't Lockwood then. Very smooth. <laughs> Dude, Lockwood, I always trip on Lockwood. That shit was steep, bro. Yeah, yeah. That that bank. And it had Ooh. a high level of gangst, gangster activity, activity around that bitch. Did you yeah. ever get fuck with there? No. No? No. Look at him. Of course he did. Dude. I mind my business and skateboard, you know what I mean? I think that's the key. You know? But I would always hear people would just get ran up on like with, mm. on their cameras well, and shit. Well, if they were going to run up on me, they will run up on me yeah. and take my board. All right, later. Where, you, where you from, leave. homie? Yeah, yeah, well, yeah, I'm from Van Nuys. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, he done uh, did it. He done did it, bro. He definitely done Yo, did it. That one. Yeah. Great. Man. I almost thought he was going to go back to Switch. It yeah. just kind of looked like, you know. Like, yeah. Didn't he do one similar to that? What do you, like Switch so. Hardflip back tail? I feel like that, yeah. Wow. Dude, he's so Dude. gnarly. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Every trick that he's done, she, go ahead and try it. Yeah. You know yeah. yeah. He got into that nice too. It's mm -hmm. like he just ollied up into it. Yeah. All you know, right. Wow. I mean, he's OG like spot too. been pro for yeah, ever. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Seriously. That's that. Is that that Eagle Rock school? Mm -hmm. mm. Where didn't Daniel have a clip there in the chocolate tour? Yep. Dude, he's so good, bro. Damn, dude. Yeah, dude. Every dude, clip, the foot went right there. Right there. Damn. I almost thought he was going to hit us with the P-Rod. He said, nope. Mm. No. You know who the fuck I am? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You're just talented, bro. He really is, man. Yo, what's up with this that rail? Dude. Did they put that? that you know, that's big dog. dog. 
The filming too. Yeah. yeah. He was Woo! up in there. That like full, I mean. Nolly flip front nose. It always Press. reminds me of Danny Montoya. Totally, he did it his yeah. way, but like, yeah. Yeah. bro. That was Damn. beautiful. Yeah, super dope, Dude, that has to be a rail that Knob Buster put in there. You think? Oh, because you think he put it in spot? there? It's what? You think he put it in there? I think he put it in. Oh, shit. I don't think oh. that. I've been to that spot. Is that in Beverly Hills? Yeah, the ledge off stairs right yeah, next to yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because that he I, just inserted the rail. I actually, actually, <laughs> I just remembered this <laughs> right rail now. Here, exactly. I, I uh, there was a kink rail there before because I ollied over it like when I was seventeen randomly. Wow. Mm. So it used to be a different rail, and that looks like a perfect yeah, maybe you did huh wow maybe that was did. beautiful yeah, yeah. Him, that was good what's the pause it at the very end there's like a sticker on the rail golden <laughs> golden days golden dogs yeah. dogs i think it's golden days golden rail we will put this rail anywhere you need. i mean man somebody google that in yeah, the, the no chat lie. right now but oh. maybe maybe not because there's a hole in the middle you see yeah, at the top see maybe that's like a knob they unknobbed it possibly yeah yeah they it looks like they unknobbed it yeah. i mean that would be beast if they put the rail Dude. in the skate wow. Wow. <laughs> that trip yeah. was insane wow and that's on his that's on his board right i don't is it on the, the white one yeah yeah yep. maybe he just no, got the board it's not it, it's not it's not cuz he he got he, the bar at the spot. No, but I don't think it was the same day. Um, maybe it was. Wait, I doubt it, though. No, that's not the no, that's, that's right. not Because right. I saw not, a clip of him not. on his Instagram. Like, he's like, oh, it's my first kickflip on my first board. Oh, got okay. it. So I was okay. like, oh, okay. Wow, that was incredible. Yeah. yeah. Fucking Is insane. that MBD? I've never seen nobody do never that. I haven't seen either. Never mm -hmm. seen yeah, I've never so, yeah. thought of that trick. Damn. Yeah, oh. why would you? I know, right? I mean, like, he... He turned all the way almost. Yeah, there was no pivot. Yeah, and there's not. He's not like land on a bank. You know what I mean? Right. Like, yeah, yeah. He rolled away. He, he rolled away, going straight forward. Mm -hmm. You have to be. Oh, that's you have to be good. <laughs> Damn. You have, you have to be, be really good. good. Yeah. You have to be really yeah. good. Yeah. This OG wow. ass yeah, spot. Let's go. Wow. El Dorado rail. God, man. Damn. He definitely man. has some Montoya. Yep. Mm -hmm. The trick selection, right? the the spot selection. Mm -hmm. like, yeah. You can tell I he's a product the, of that. I watched the Ooh. One Step Beyond part of his the other day. Mm. The his end, the last tricks was part gets me so hyped because everyone there is like mm. hyped. Yeah, you know? I love watching footage where everyone's hyped when they land a trick. Yeah. Yeah. Congratulations, JP. Dude, Dude, well deserved, man. Well deserved. Guys, phenomenal. Been fucking ruling for so long. Phenomenal skateboarder, bro. Go check him out. Visual uh, parts. The links in the video description below. You want to go check out his part? Amazing, yeah, Nolly heel front crook, mm, bro. Mm -hmm. Super gnarly, and he's not really a handrail dude, right? You know what I mean? To get that he's, tech, that's pretty. Yeah. He's got those tricks, man. Uh -oh. mm. Here we go. That's a vibe right there. I work with that one. Damn. I think it's I, I didn't know Tame and Paula knew about our show. <laughs> that was, I thought like Jamiroquai said it. Yeah. Yeah. That yeah. shit was funky as fuck right there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's picking the weed. <laughs> yeah. I love how you go Jamiroquai. Yeah. That was. That was some Jamiroquai. Oh, I have a picture of Steve's just walking backwards. On the <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> that was sent in. <laughs> that was sent in by Adam They're from that video. Right? <laughs> that was sent in by Adam Party. Party. Ex I Adam know, Party. I, exactly. Perfect. Yep. Exactly. He's Adam got, Party. Yeah, he's got a band called uh, Car Iroquois? Caro. <laughs> <laughs> Caro. Caro's the name of his band. Awesome. Yeah, he's got yep. canned heat in his heels. Go, go, check, him out. <laughs> go check him out, man. Yeah. Caro, the band, got uh, at Instagram. I, I want to party with Adam. Here we go. That was a vibe right there. Yep. I had to give it oh, to shit. him. Oh, wow. Because it's been raining. <laughs> <laughs> Shane O'Neill. And I just, oh. you know, because sometimes you got to, you know, I like to pick people that don't really are in the scene, but dude, this shit <laughs> yeah, was... Dude. Unbelievable. Mm -hmm. Shane is 
God, a special skateboarder, man. Right. Yeah. And shout out to, I think, was it Kevin Yo Yo that had to stand out in the rain? <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, right. <laughs> I was actually tripping on this because, like, you know, when it's slippery, you can slip out really quick. Yeah. Mm-hmm. The way that he slipped out was very nonchalant. Like yeah. he was expecting. Yeah. Like he just yeah. said. He just said. Mm-hmm. He knew. Yeah. Because yeah. he's like, not human. Yeah. If you Him want and to... P Rod, man, they got like Paul does the thing behind his. his yeah. Hand but watch, him. watch yeah. how easily he like. Just. Boop, just okay. Boop. <laughs> it was such a slow fall. Slow yeah. fall. Slow yeah. fall in the rain. Dude. Also, he's wearing a purple rain shirt while skating in the rain. Purple. Yeah. There you go. Damn. I just saw him at Diamonds sense. the other day skating in the park. It is unreal to watch that dude in person. Yeah. Like this. Yeah. This, this stuff. Yeah. It's really easy for him. Oh, mm-hmm. absolutely. Yeah, it's like, it's funny too when you see him skate and he doesn't like something. You're like, yo, that was literally perfect. Mm-hmm. He's like, no, 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 I have He's one like, time. Yep. <laughs> like watching him at the barracks, like go straight onto the flat bar and balance 5 0 in the middle yeah. of his truck. Yeah. That's laughable. I'm just like, like, bro, what are you? No, that's, yeah. that, that's not humanly it's possible. Not, yeah, right. <laughs> it, ain't, it ain't right, man. Mm-mm. It ain't right. So and it's, fu- it's funny, yeah. like, dude, Pat Duffy. Yep. Back lip in the rain. Mm-hmm. I know this is his house and he does this shit, but like the progression of skateboarding and how mm-hmm. this is how done is in the rain. It's just, it just, <laughs> just rain. It's sketchy. It's so yeah. sketchy. It's sketchy. You slip out like no other. Yeah. Unpredictable. Let's, let's give him a little soundtrack. Dude. This might go good. Yeah. Here we go. Dude, it almost sounded like that Outcast too. That fucking um, they um, had the double album. Um, the was love one below song, and the, then yeah. the speaker box. What yes, was it? Um, that's the one. Uh, not bombs over Baghdad. Was it? No. Was it? It might have been. It, the, 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 the song I'm thinking was bombs was on that album. Yeah, mm-hmm. one or the other. But I just can't. I can't pick Intro the actual Nash, song. Underground, underground. When but I the way that pound. thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Elephants. I'm super back of Rangan tank. I can't stop the train. Something like that. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. That was in the chocolate tour too. Okay. No, ghetto music was oh, ghetto, ghetto music, music was yeah. in uh, hot chocolate. Hey, shout out Adam Party. Killed the it. band, his band's called uh, Caro. Go check him out, man. Caro the band. If you want to send in your own pick of the week song, just email it to pick of the week at the nine club That was good. Make that sure was it's original. your own song. No, no, you know, no, you know, original music. You know, twenty seconds, thirty seconds. It's uh, funny going into that. I was like, it's just be some budget ass fucking. It kind of sounded, yeah. Yeah, yeah. they even. And yeah. then the production like yeah. kind of picked yeah. up. He knew yeah. what he was yeah. doing. Yeah, it was it was a slow build. Yeah. It and went then from, he just uh, fucking banged us over the head. As Dubs would say, budget to, to budget buttery. To buttery. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder from, if that was his thought process. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Justin. Please. Nine Club. Hey, hey. hard. That's hey. well deserved. Is there like a nine? Oh, okay. Straight nine. Nine. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Y'all looked at me kind of funny when I said, Tame and Paul, I'm going to you, play you a little bit after the show and let y'all hear it's similar to that's okay. very there you go yeah. good I'm gonna broaden your there's your reference <laughs> yeah. Yeah. love it uh, this video came out this week and uh, really 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 good Nordic Light came mm. out uh, great skateboarding in here man let's just jump right into it bro we got uh, Simon Hallberg I believe Ooh, little barley. Shout out Donnie Barley. There you go, man. Stockholm. Barley grind. Sweet. It's funny. I wonder if people do this trick now and know no. where it came from. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I wonder if people know it. Donnie Barley. Right. I mean, it has to come up. I, I wouldn't be surprised if kids these days don't even but they, know. Yeah. Like, I don't. The Smith grind? Yeah. You'd probably just say 180 Switch Smith. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Because I think, like, I mean, obviously, whatever, but like the, the TikTok trends of like kids that were born in 96 listening to the songs from, you know, 2001. They don't know what the fuck it is. Right. I can imagine the same with skateboarding. Yeah. For, sure. You know? For sure. For sure. But a, you have to have the OGs kind of kicking down the knowledge. Let oh, you know, sure. Like, hey, that, that, that's I would not hope called so. that. Yeah. It's called the, the barley. Yeah. yeah. Right. Uh, here's Mira Axelson. Heel flips. Yeah, she's ripping. She killed it. Yeah. yeah. Nice to see a little no comply, you know. Mm-hmm. It's kind of cool. Is this a Vans video? 
think they yeah uh, at the just, end I think yeah. they supported it's it or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. It's, uh, Tommy Bjork. <laughs> I this randomly this dude amazing. hit me up the other day on Instagram, but I remember Tommy Budgenick. He rode for Duffs and he backtailed the rail. I just thought of him. I don't know why. <laughs> I just didn't know. I was like, Tommy Budgenick? I was like, oh no, Tommy Bjork. I was like, all right. Sorry, I was random. Yeah. None of you guys knew who I was talking no, about. No, we have nope. no idea. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He watches the show. That's cool. <laughs> Budgenick sounded kind of cool. <laughs> Here's a Samuel oh, Norgren. Samuel Norgren. With the little wall ride, yeah, that was dope. Oh, oh okay. I've been oh, seeing a lot oh, more fakey okay. hards lately, dude. I like that. Boom, boom, mm. boom. Whoops. Here's a uh, Johan Berglajon. Mm. Ooh, that's a spicy yeah, he one. That shit out right there. Mm -hmm. That was a little fakey feeble. That's wow. This foot setup for that, like, made you think he was gonna try something way yeah, different. Yeah, fakey yeah. flip, yeah, fakey yeah, yeah. 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 thought that boy was flipping. That's yeah. for sure. I was like, what? That is the not what I was expecting. Dude, and he to the lock. Yeah. The half cap out of that was really mm -hmm. pin. That's the Dude. opposite of the way Carol does it, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Because he does exactly. like fakey yeah. front feeble. I guess. Oh, that's be. right. Mm -hmm. yeah. Fakey hurricane. I guess you would say. Yeah. Damn, that was okay, super yeah. dope. Yeah, he did it really dope. Here's a uh, Samuel what? Norgren. I thought he fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, not that not was, really. I got that. That was insane. <laughs> uh, let's keep going here, man. Simon Hallbrook again. Love a good little pop out. That's what, wood, too. It's yeah. a wood bridge? Looks like a little playground area or some shit. Elbridge. It does look kind of small, go. huh? Like for kids. Yeah. Mm. Little kid handrail. Mm -hmm. Oh. Like one for babies, like that one time. Yep. Well, there, 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 baby, there, baby rail? rail? Yeah. yeah. They're Why out there. does that baby need a rail? They're out there. <laughs> <laughs> hey, baby. Um, let's see what this guy. Yeah, oh, look at that block. Yeah, they got rad spots. Yeah. Yeah. Wally back nose grind. That's crazy. Look how good that block is. It's just there. Look at the background too. There's stairs. They got these ledges yeah. down fucking stairs. Like damn. what? Is that a, oh, it is. That's a, a skate, skate park. park. Oh, yeah. Okay, right. but it's like it doesn't really look, look like a park, real. Though. Yeah, you, you can't fool us. <laughs> That's why I always wondered. I was like, why don't these? We build a place so people can make a, re yeah. a living off of where it doesn't look like a skate park. Right. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like yeah. a love park that, you know. Yeah. In a perfect mm -hmm. world, man. I know, That's right? what it would be. So mm -hmm. let me ask you this. You wouldn't consider that a slappy. That would be a Wally back nose guy. I think it's a Wally. Wally? Okay. I mean, right? Yeah. I think you think you're, because you're actually going up. Yeah, it's a Wally. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it could be called both, I guess. Yeah. I don't. I, 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 I just, my, my first was Wally. Mm -hmm. You yeah, get comments no matter what. So yeah, that's true. I'm never. No, right. man, that's a fucking slappy. No, that's we're, a wall right. It's, it's, we're, ne we're never right. <laughs> we're, we're never right. Nikolaya Allen. No, roll on Nolly fifty fifty. Is that what that was? <laughs> Kinda. Even that's, though it wasn't technically roll on. Yeah, so I'm throw that back. No, there's uh, a, it's a little bit to it, right? Yeah, no, I move, feel like move he, your mic to the. Oh, sorry. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. I feel like he had a kind of nolly behind him almost. God, if you ever see me uh, in a shirtless line, just tell me to stop. Can't wait. Just be like, you know, crab. <laughs> the reason I pull this clip uh, is he actually hits the chain when he kickflips over. Oh, oh the I have to watch it that. again. Hard to see. He did slightly move. Oh yeah, he did. Look at that. Mm -hmm. dude, that the is, chain. Dude, that's been happening quite often. Yeah. We're banking off shit, making shit look better. See, we didn't even know we didn't even notice that. No. Yeah. So we that can't. was meant to happen that way. Dude, I, every time I see a person rolling up to a chain, scary. Scary. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You know some sort of hippie jumps coming. <clears throat> oh my god. Or even if they catch up in that, mm -hmm. see ya. You can get got. Yeah. Here's Tom Botwick. This shit is dope. Yeah, man. Like, is that a I don't even know what, but he did it. It's a Wally. Wally back yeah, lip? Yeah, that, that. Look, 
Yeah. Ooh. Damn. But this one, no, that's a it's not. Is it a slappy? That's, that's a slappy. Well, because he raised his. Right. What? But, but it's the same size as the other one. On the, the no one. slide, he kind of. But what was he trying to accomplish on that last trick? Lips right. back, Wally back lip, I'm assuming. Was it? I thought it was Wally back lip. Yeah. But... I feel like there was like some sort of hurricane going on. Hold on. Hold on. Hurricane on the other side. I think think he grinded the other side. That was dope. (laughs) Tom Botwick. I fucking don't ever think I'd be able to do that. Mm -mm. Yeah. Would never even think of that. Uh uh. Here's a. Look how empty that place looks. Oh, here's here's Mira Axelson again. Uh, Oh, yeah. With the ill little small wheels. (laughs) (laughs) Yes. That's tight. It's like a 45's on the no, no. Dude, that's like the first tech trick. Like you learn so, that, you're like you like stepped up your game. Yeah, you yeah, stepped yeah. it up. That's Straight a big up. part in when you're learning tricks, man. That's a big one. Yeah. Once you learn a kickflip, sky's the limit. Yeah. 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 You do a grind and add a kickflip. Yeah. yeah. Bro, yeah, you start 50 50, then the jump to yeah. shift your feet. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Johan yeah. I think. Apologize if I'm not getting these right. Chris, I know. you give the best I effort every day. Tough, bro. I appreciate uh. that, Tubbs. Spot, dude. dude spots, bro. Spot. That Damn. flat gap and then trick over a trash can right after? And then a bench. Buttery lens. The ground looks great. What? Where is this? Hey, Wait, was that? Maybe like was that? Sweden yeah, was... or Stockholm? Oh, yes, it was oh, Stockholm. Nordic okay. uh, Lights. Is that what the video is called? Yep. Boom. Oh. Yeah, that was dope. Uh, oh, here's Tommy again. Tommy, Boy, Tommy, Tommy Bork. Ooh, mm. that, that was rocking dope. Rocking the half caps, man. Dude, they look really good to skate, actually. They, I've never they, skated a pair. Those are, are, you can tell those are fresh out the box. Yeah. Right? That's why, yeah. They're good. Some of these spots look fucking rugged, but they, they work it out. Here's Tom again, Tom Botwood. Oh, that was cool. Man, he does not like popping his balls. Mm. Uh-uh. I can relate to him, man. <laughs> <laughs> Same. Well, I mean, they, you, those legs are too too tall for you, Chris. Mm-hmm. I'll get At up. I'll, I'll, get, I'll get up there. You I did. just don't want to. <laughs> That's all. Those legs. It's funny you say that. Someone man. hit me on the gram the other day and was like, "Sir, you're just getting curves these days." But like, they meant it in the best way. Sure. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and I'm just like, I didn't even respond. I had to like. So you're hearing my response right now. <laughs> you're paying attention you're in that um, no that's not all what i do i've skate other things as well you just happen to catch a nice little day yeah, that's right that's right i want to see like a, a little big spin from you you did one holding your phone hella good oh, yeah, ones and at i was girl, like at girl how did you do that that's like because every time i try to do like the tray flip mm. and hold my phone i dude I can never get myself in. That was my yeah. first and only time doing that, and I, 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 I finally got to see how hard that shit was. I was like, what? you did it perfect. I appreciate it. Yeah, hell yeah. Moa, Moa, we'll be doing some street shit soon. Moa Xander and Mira Axelson. Dude, she's really dope. I, dude. Oh, I, I, she is too. Uh. Uh, I love the, I love this look on her face, just like. Just gonna go up and skate this thing. <laughs> yeah. You know, like super mellow. Yeah. I'm gonna do this. What that's a rad spot too. Do a little bank right there. Yeah, that'd be fun. Wow. Oh, super sick. Uh oh, here's some more Tommy, bro. This oh, one? Beautiful. Is this the one? Yeah. Yep. Oh my god. That shit was so good. Yeah, that was pretty amazing. That was beautiful. It was beautiful. Just bop bop. That was sick. Wow. That was super cool. Dude, those old schools look sick. I think Greco would have fun on those things. Mm. Mm-hmm. Or skate highs? What are, uh, yeah, skate highs. I'm sorry. Oh, Talk about... Like, go ahead, sorry. No. What? I was just going to say, that was like mesmerizing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, it, talk about board control. Yeah. yeah like yeah, You're like on top full, of your shit. Full blown. Board you control. just pop, pop, pop. Like a little play toy. Just very, graceful, yeah. Very fluid as mm-hmm. well. Yes. Didn't stop and... It was like on Pause. boom, boom, boom. So it was on good. Beat, you know? yeah, it was why? Very comfortable. He had a metronome in his head. Mm. It's not a big <laughs> deal, but why did they put the graphics right in the middle of the trick? I don't know. They've been doing that for a few times. Different. This whole video. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Maybe I like didn't. After I watched it so many times, mm-hmm. I, I finally picked it up. Okay, cool. So I was like, did he do 5 0 stall? And then you can't really 
mm-hmm. tell. That was sick as fuck. Wow. Tommy Bjork on fire. He's yeah. killing it. Good combo. That might have been Pebble Tech. No, I'm just saying. Oh. Just <laughs> it looks it looks pretty pebblish right there. Bro, like does, he's trying to get his pool ready for the summer. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Every episode, Pebble Tech, if you listen listening. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to revert my pool into Pebble Tech. Thank you. <laughs> Hit that algorithm. Oh, man. That'd, That'd be amazing if someone at Pebble Tech was just listening to this right now. Bro, there's got to be at least one skater. Pebble, <laughs> <laughs> Pebble Tech, Pebble Tech, Pebble, Pebble Tech. <laughs> that was very interesting. Usually I'm I not a big that. fan of like something up to manual. Yeah. You know what I mean? I don't think the I've way seen he this did it. The way he that did one. that was sick. Yeah, that was, he did that great. Vincent Alvarez reposted this thing. Mm-hmm. If you are a skateboarder, you should follow Vincent Alvarez first right. and foremost. But when he posts something, you know yeah. that it's yeah. Yeah. pretty good. Yeah. You know why this is cool too? Because like, if he did back lip to up to nose, Manny, mm-hmm. that's, it's, it's like a little. You know, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. When they do something on a ledge and then they just kind of go up into it, but shove it in. Yeah. Like you leave your board for a second to go and land on it. Yeah, that's an MVD for sure. I don't think Dude. I've ever seen that yeah, shit. Right. I haven't seen that shit front side, lip side. So there's definitely no way Dude, I've seen it back side. It looked so. really cool. He too. didn't touch at all. No. It was Ooh, so perfect. good. Yeah, it was wow. You know, when he landed that, that was like, mm. oh, that, that, felt that good. was a good feeling. Yeah, right is it the bro. same dude did the kickflip 5 0 yeah. back lid? Yeah. Tommy Bjork. Same shoes. Yeah. Tommy Bjork. Bjork. Wow. Wow. Anybody with the name Bjork? I don't know, you know I mess with them. <laughs> There's no Tommy Bjork. Bjork. What is it? Uh, what was, what's her name's? Oh, man. Bjork. No, no, no. Oh. <laughs> the artist. Um, the artist known as Bjork. The musician. We'll come back to you, Kelly. <laughs> was it at Wayne's World or something? Uh, I can't Dude, remember. that was something. Tell me, Kelly. <laughs> tell, me what, tell me what you're talking about. Yeah, this shit's weird. Dude, on the fucking... So the, amazing. The Mario Whoa. drains. God. <laughs> 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 That is straight wow. MVD like no other. God, so uncomfortable. I mean, yeah. What do you like? What do you want to do? Right, all you up yeah. on these and tray flip off. What do you want to film? How at night? <laughs> <laughs> Bring your light <laughs> from your camera. <laughs> it would be amazing if they actually lit it up. Like God, hey, light, right? Right? Yeah, God lights everything there. Ooh, Ooh, wait, wait, that? wait, wait. That was cool. There's a kickflip body varial revert. Damn. It almost looked dolphin flipish in a weird way. But it's Ooh. not. Ooh. What? Damn, he confused the okay. fuck out of me. <laughs> it's like a tray flip revert, but not. That was cool. Man, that was a kickflip shove and he caught it halfway. Well, no, the- watch his body. The board stays straight. Yeah. Oh, no, that's him. really kind that's of tricky. tricky. It's cool. It's tricky, man. You okay. fucked me up right there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm just trying to think about trying that right now. Like it, how you would initially start. You're like, dude, this is the tray flip one. No, no, because he's landing. The tray flip one, you it's land on a different foot. Yeah, the, the other foot. Yeah, you land on the nose. Oh, you land on yeah, the nose. Right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you right. You right. That one, he turns his body. The so other his back foot, the back foot. Yeah. Turns his body, weird. then pivots. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Jesus. That's pretty weird. So he turned it and then went back to. Yep. Back but to his regular. board was turning, though. No, his board didn't turn. It like slightly kind of turned. It turned but it back. It, but he, he. Okay, so then he turned it back. Yeah. He, he kick flipped. Yep. And then said, whoop. Yep. Wow. Oh, That's cool. Yeah, keep a body very old. You okay? okay? Um, he got me. You okay? He got me. <laughs> Dubs over here I'm tripping. like, bro, really? <laughs> For real. Smoke, smoke about to Jesus. come out the headset. It really is. Because <laughs> 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 imagine if he just did the kickflip body, he would land switch yes, stance. Yes, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Very cool, man. Get him, bro. That was cool. Tommy Bjork doing it. This guy's killing it, dude. Mm-hmm. That was cool, man. I like that sweatshirt. I could see you rocking. I like mm-hmm. that one. Uh, yeah, that's like some uh, reminds me of the golf the floor Tyler the Creator shit he was doing. Mm-hmm. Gompers. Mm-hmm. Last trick, Simon Hallberg. 
Oh. Ooh. A little 50-50 late show. It okay. was a late show. I thought it was a front to show, but beer late show. show. It's a beer guzzle. Mm-hmm. Looks like Scott Johnston, like young Scott Johnston. His homie. Oh, I was going to say. No, no, no. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no <it was> like <laughs> that. I mean, I just... I can see that. A little, 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 little bit. I can see that. young SJ. Yeah, maybe not. <laughs> there you go, man. Nordic Light. Great video. Go check him out. Yeah, it was dope. Links so in the video description below. So you, fucking rippers out there. You brought up Scott Johnson, and I saw on Instagram, I think Vintage Skate posted the clip of Half Cap No Slighted at uh, LACC. Oh, yeah. But then after, you see Jerron's there, Ave, Ave uh, Tony Ferguson. Yeah. yeah. And uh, uh, why I think am I, that was it. I think that was. Aaron Mesa filmed it. Mesa filmed it. And yeah. I was just like, bro, that was such a sick time right there. Mm. Was that used? That was used, That was right? in, uh, yeah, yeah was, right. Yeah, yeah. 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 That was just, gnarly. Just seeing the whole clip, though, that's when you're just like, damn, was that used? Like, yeah. you're hearing, hearing your voice at the end? I forget what you said, but it was I like... I know, I'm saying some random <laughs> shit. <laughs> he did like, that shit. <laughs> 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 I heard some dumb shit. I just thought that was so cool. Like, damn, there's dubs. That's yeah. Yeah. sick. Gosh. I'd like to take this opportunity to give a special shout out to our sponsors, man. Dickies, man. Santa Cruz, Rick De Wheels, Mob Grip Tape. Thank you guys so much for the support. Jeez, the yes. support means a lot to us and thank everybody out there who supports us. And that just means, you know, if you're a channel member, thank you guys so much. If you just watch the show, you tune in, you listen to the show, you give a thumbs up, you give a, a comment, you give a little like, you subscribe. Thank you guys so much. It just, it definitely means the world to us, you know. Literally keeps the lights on. It does. Yep. It does. Yeah, no doubt. And um, also I'd like to give a special shout out because, um, Jerron blew up LD's spot last time, so I'm gonna blow up Jerron's spot, man. Happy birthday, Jerron! Oh, yeah. happy, happy birthday, birthday, dog. birthday yeah. bro! Big dog, What's starting up? off Black History Month. Yes, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? February first. February first. Hey, happy birthday, bro! Thank you, bro. The age of Aquarius. It is the age of Aquarius. <laughs> My big dog. Damn. There's a lot Aquarius. of us in there. I know. I had mentioned that the other day in our uh, girl chocolate group chat. We got a quite a few Aquarius is in that chat. Oh, sure. You know, Kenny, oh. Kenny, Carl, Carl, Rick, Wow, McCrank. Yes. Okay. LD, myself. There's a lot of yes, us. That's five. Like I that's, love it, that's, bro. that's yeah. a big portion right there. Aquarius is. Yeah. Boom. 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 <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to do? Uh, it's going to be, I got just, was just talking with LD. Uh, it's going to be a mellow day. I'm going to go out and probably hit the golf course, not golf course, but uh, hit the driving range and hit the, hit the ball a little bit. Cause yeah. I'm going, ex- dude, I didn't even get to run this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is this what you called me on? Yeah. I okay. called you earlier. Yeah. <laughs> um, uh, on Tuesday, yeah. cause we're supposed to be recording. Okay. Uh, I, I, might, I might have to have an extended day where we might have to reschedule. Whoa. I don't want to reschedule, but like, I don't want to be rushed in my game with my boys on on, on my birthday. Who LD's going? LD is going. He's going. <laughs> oh. D- Dubs double booked. <laughs> God damn it, dude. Dubs double I didn't, booked. I didn't, I didn't double book. Someone double booked for, on my behalf. Yeah, for LD, my birthday. Thanks, bro. Yeah, my birthday. <laughs> You're sabotaging the other show. I know. What? I didn't sabotage anything. <laughs> no. we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. Yeah, we'll yes. figure it out. Yes. We'll figure it out. Yes. Yeah, I'm open. I've got. Thanks, no, I've got Chris. nothing going on. You know, I just sit at home. Thank God. We'll I just sit at home and wait for the call. We'll work it out. <laughs> I check the, uh, check the calendar. I say, oh, look, we're filming tonight. Okay. Chris is very mellow in that sense. Yeah, I, I can't complain in that yeah. sense. So. Yeah. Dude, every time you text Chris, like in a group chat, like, hey, what about six o'clock this? I'm down for whatever. Yeah. Every, his response every single time. He, he wants to make it work. <laughs> I'll make it work, yeah. bro. I'll make it work, He bro. works it out. I work it out. Straight up. Uh, one thing that I do want to mention really quickly, and uh, this is a shout out to uh, the locals here uh, in Santa Monica, Stoner Park and stuff. They just came out with a video. Kevin touched on it for a second, but I wanted to give a special shout out to them. Uh, Dream 2021 Movieville is the name of the video. We're going to review it next week. So why don't you all go there? Links in the description. Go give it a like. Go give it a watch. Yep. And yes, uh, go check it out because they, they did a phenomenal job on this, man. It's on uh, Tristan Warren's YouTube channel. So go check them out. Yeah. Like I said, go give them a thumbs up. Go give them a subs- subscribe. 
go watch the video. You know what I'm saying? Great Dude, it was an awesome video. It got me ha- all these seeing all these kids grow up at Stoner. It's so funny. Bro. Yeah, it's, it's so funny. So funny. Skater Pat, dude. Yeah, he was ripping, w- ripping. <laughs> yeah, um, Mingus, Mingus, ri- ripping. All the kids, Avi, dude. dude. So, go check out the video. Dream 2021 Movieville is the name of the video. It's on uh, Tristan Warren's YouTube. Again, go give him a thumbs up. And yeah, there's cater footage, like, cater footage there in there too. There you go, man. Super ill. So shout out to them. Just came out with this video. Amazing. Oh yeah. Katsuya. Yep. Dude. Boom. Oh, Katsuya. Yeah. Boom. Mm. So good. So talented good. skateboarders. So let's move this right along, man. We got Roman. Oh gosh. We have videos and stuff. Roman yes, Liz Lizvica. That's a crazy Lizvica. photo. Lizvica. Lizvica. All right. Roman Liz Lizifica. That's a spot, Ska. <laughs> uh, dude, dude, dude killed it, bro. Dude killed it. Ooh. Yeah. He definitely did. <clears throat> that spot. That's right next to Sons, isn't it? It's like right Is down it? the street, I'm pretty sure, yeah. I don't know. Primitive guy? Yeah. 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 Pro for primitive. No, I don't know if he's pro. Didn't Is he? Didn't he turn him pro? No, that was Ma- 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 Merrick. Merrick, yeah. You're Merrick. right. Dude. You're right. I think him and Merrick are from both from the same town. That's why. Yeah. yeah. That's why. Oh. He brought the little homie along. That spot looks fucking good. Yeah, that's that's awesome. Look at that fucking clouds in the back. This oh. looks amazing. Look at the clouds, fool. Yes. <laughs> dude. Cumulus. That, yeah, I don't know why. I looked at the board. Like the color of the board looks super dope. I think in the next clip you're gonna show, I think mm. uh, it shows it better. But that young color correction. <laughs> it's like a let me know. This it's like looks, a forest green. Yeah. Oh, because it's fully dipped, huh? Yeah, it looks. Mm. Fun. That Ooh. was amazing. Wow. Dude. That was super dope. And how rare is it you can see the place that place like that? Empty. 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 Yeah. Empty. Mm-hmm. Wow, huh? Yeah, he did. And that's like, God, what is this, early in the morning? Is this it like, might just... No, look mid-day. at the sun. Midday? Yeah. yeah. This like place noon. is usually a circus. Yeah. yeah. It's right, Chris? Yeah. No matter what time of day, really. Or morning is obviously the best time, yeah? Yeah. Dude, I trip on people who do stuff like this in a line. Like, for sh- sure, the first trick yeah. was, you mm-hmm. know, not crazy. But still, but still yeah. dude. It's like... Dude, you did it solid as you could do it. Yeah. You got to know you were going to do it like really oh, yeah. fast. It's almost Somewhere. like with that stuff too, it's like flow. Like you, the first trick is f- in the flow. You're right. Bum, 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 and then the bum, bum, bum. I mean, sometimes it does help. <laughs> I love that. Sometimes it does help to get that momentum. Right. Going. That's you what I'm saying. The flow. Then, yeah. yeah. I feel you. So that was a crazy one. He was definitely in it. Dude, that's what? such a smooth it, manual. It looks like it's going that. downhill. Mm. Right? It's a tough one to pop. Yeah. Fakie front and shove. And it was, a, yep, the front, the fakie front shove, not just the fakie pop. Damn. Damn. That was dope. Nolly's easier. Uh, it's both Nolly's awkward, easier. huh? Yeah. Is that funny how his how his shoe looks, the front foot? It looks yeah, like it's it looks like, like, like it's suede, but... A little dainty ass, little like cat <laughs> shoe. <laughs> cat shoe. I was watching this the whole. I think they're Bruins, but I was trying to Look figure at that out the whole. Baby shoe. I know it was funny because the front, yeah, the front one looks like a suede because he's been skating it so much, and yeah. the back one's leather. It's like he's got no soul. Right? Yeah, it's like, yeah. It's like really, yeah. Thin, really it's thin. baby shoe. <laughs> he's wearing big baby shoes. Big baby shoes. I'll tell you what though, probably super comfy. I'll to take skate that baby in, shoe doing mm-hmm. that shoe I'll take that straight up. Ah, oh, what what dainty shoe you wearing? Damn, look at that spot. spot man. Those baby shoes right there. Yeah, he no. ran those leather Bruins the whole. Fucking those are the park. Adidas ones, right? No, nah, he's on Nike. Oh yeah, that shit was working for him. Mm-hmm. Straight up. Damn, he did that good. What? Look at that spot, dude. Yeah, so good. Benches by the beach. Inspiration. <laughs> Straight up to get your shit. That's what it's gonna look like at that spot. Yeah. Uh, oh, oh, oh. That is that the same spot that Walker did the switch tray 5-0? Remember that? I think it is, man. We don't stop think, it. I yet. think you're right. I think you're right. Look so at those ledges, good. ledges for days, man. Yeah, Where's this at again? I think it's in Spain somewhere. Damn, man. Oh, that was so good. Probably not in Barcelona. Probably outside yeah, somewhere. I think he yeah. said. What do you say, Alicante? 
Maybe. But didn't he say? Never he brought up uh, the dude that wrote for. Uh, look at Luipa. Right. Yeah, Luipa in the Luipa. background. What shoes are those? Luipa. Oh, gee. I'm pretty sure they're the Bruin Lows, but I could be wrong. I'm not 100. percent I was trying to figure it out the whole time. I want them. Hey, good <laughs> stuff. Yeah, scuba. Yeah, there you go. Mm-hmm. Scuba. Good stuff, Roman Liz- Lizifica. Dude, Met- Roman's ill. Metronome Noir part. It's the name man. of the video, bro. Go check it out, man. Get, get to do rips. I would love to see a na- his name on a board. He's been holding down for <clears throat> Primitive for a while. Yeah, man. I like seeing yeah. Luipa, man. Look at that dude. Dude, he's OG. He's yeah. OG, OG. G. Triple OG. Triple OG. He's got one of those styles. You watch, you're like, oh, that's Luipa. You mm-hmm. Don't have to say his name, you just know. Luipa. <laughs> <laughs> Straight up. Love that dude, man. Uh, here's an interesting piece that I really thought was amazing. Was uh, let's see if I have a thumbnail for it. Yeah. Oh yes, this was awesome. Jankum Ian Mishna did a little interview with uh, Werner Herzog, and I thought it was f- fascinating, dude. I it was cool that it was just so short and sweet. Yeah, you know, it wasn't mm. this crazy long interview. It was what four minutes long. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was really good, bro. Random. Yeah. Random. How did he? I wonder Super how, random. How did he get in contact with him? From what it sounded like, he probably reached out to some PR or yeah, something. I'm sure he's got a publicist. I missed this one. I didn't get to get to this Dude, one. Dude, you should, it's interesting. What was the premise behind it? What is it? What are we? What was he inter- being interviewed about? It's about just skateboarding. Skateboarding. Just in general. Like just him looking at skating just, and like what his thoughts are. Okay. Okay. Because he 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 directed. A bunch of like, what was he known for? He directed a bunch of like, um, God, I wish I off the top of my head. Oh, the Grizzly Bear, the Grizz. He just did, uh, oh, yeah, Grizzly Man. He did, um, Lo and Behold, the internet wow. movie. Thanks, Raj. So um, funny though, man. That real, that real is fucking psycho. <laughs> <I know. laughs> but it was awesome. He, he's like showing him. It's like explain to him how skateboarding works. Mm. This dude is like destroying himself to do this one trick. Right. And this it's just It's a good watch. Yes. Okay. It's a good watch. Yeah, it's it's, it's, it's not easy to describe. You just have to watch it. Yes. It's really yeah. not. Yeah. Great, great. Man. Dude, Ian's smile always right makes me laugh. Dude. And this is what I tell Ian when he was on the show. I said, Ian, man, you got to do some more stuff in front of the camera, bro. You're great. Yes. He's really good at what he does, but he's always behind the scenes. Mm-hmm. I'm like, you got to get him uh, up in there, bro. Mm-hmm. So he I said was he, stoked to see this. He said he was going to work on that and he, he was doing it. Yeah. I've seen lots of pieces. The Brandon Turner piece. Yep. He's yeah, in it. It's a great yeah. piece. Great piece. Oh, I loved what he said about David Blaine. Mm-hmm. Mm. Because he was like, he's just doing he's it like, for... just publicity. He's not doing it for anything else. Yeah. yeah. I was like, I never really thought of that. I was yeah, like, he's not doing it for the passion like skateboarding. Right. Was yeah. he there for that David Blaine piece? No, he just brought it up. I don't know why it came into conversation about okay. like magic and shit like that, but... He was like, basically stuff he's doing is just to get publicity. It's not because he actually loves, right. like he was saying, like, like you don't sit at home and hold your breath for 10 hours or 10, whatever, mm-hmm. how long he did because you love it. Right, yeah. you're just doing you're it. You're doing it for shock value. Yeah, yeah. yeah. like skaters do the shit because they love it. You know, right? And that is a big difference. Go, go, give it a watch. It's it's really interesting and really good. He asked good questions. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They really thought the, thought it out well. I think. Look at that guy. <laughs> <laughs> Loves it. I want to watch all his, his stuff. I don't think I've seen it before. But like the Grizzly Man one is mm. that what you said, Roger? That's the one I've known. Like I've heard about. Yeah, like a lot of his films, whatever, he like really goes into it, like deep dives into it and like mm. almost like a skater where you just won't give up. Okay. Amazing. He's wow. the same way with oh, okay. the correlation. Oh, nice. But I love that. It's just outside the like let's talk with let's talk with Warner Herzog. Yeah. <laughs> like who even thought of that? Yeah. Definitely Ian for oh, yeah. sure. Now, hey, shout out to Ian. Oh, he yeah. sent me a clip this morning of him jump roping in his house oh, and I got all fucking inside. <laughs> there it is. He hit his quota. Here we go. Yes. No more. No more for the rest of the show. No more for the rest of the show. All right, all right. Hey, here's an honorable mention though, because uh, we're 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 fans of of Blondie, and uh, he just started a podcast, the Blondie Show. Uh, haven't given it a listen. I think there's only one 
episode. It may even be like a introduction to it, right, Raj? Mm. I think it's not an actual full episode. It's not a 30 minute episode. It's just him talking. Okay. It's really great. Listen. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Awesome. Is it like current event or is it just, what is it? He kind of talks about, um, you know, leaving palace, starting his brand oh, and, okay. um, you know, talking about fashion world and just different stuff like that. Leading, I was going to say, leading into what it's going to be. Yeah. I was going to say, I, I, he's into so much stuff besides skateboarding that I'm sure it's going to be a very interesting I love that. topic yeah. by yeah. topic, sure episodic, will. you yeah. know, it's podcast. Really well produced too. There you go. Awesome. You got to be for a podcast, man. Sometimes the people will be like, Hey, check out this podcast. And I turn it on and it's the worst sound I've ever heard. Mm. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, you're doing a, You've ever yeah, heard it. Like, you're doing a pod. You should you like, should have some good equipment. You should if that's like, the only thing you're doing. Right. Yeah. Yeah. If it's if it's just audio, you should you should be on point. You should have some get some oh, that's good to hear though. Let me hear you. Get a little microphone. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a anyway. little. Hey, some you gotta start somewhere. I, I yeah. understand. Dude, they yeah. saw a we first started it, the pilot episode. <laughs> That shit. Well, that's uh, why it never came out. Yeah. <laughs> that shit made me laugh out. looking at it. I'm like, damn. Chris, my, I feel like you're kind of embarrassed to show it, maybe. Not embarrassed. It's good to talk about it, though. You know, yeah. let people keep it. Maybe you should just maybe toes. reveal that. I don't think so, Dad. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, that would have the most views, though. It probably, it probably would. Leave it at that. It probably would. It's embarrassing. I go back and watch the first couple of I'm like, whoa. Wow. <laughs> You're like, Whoa, bro. I've come a long way. I'm not. <laughs> God. Should we do a recut and just do all the bloopers? Noin Club. Man, the whole thing, bro. Dude, Noin Club has been going off lately, bro. Jeez, he's got some good ones. He's always great. Yeah. <laughs> but as you said, you got to start somewhere, right? Yeah. You got to start somewhere, man. Yeah. We had to, you know, it was good. It was okay. But now we're, <laughs> now we're fully, fully kicking, bro. In it. We are in it, man. Speaking of in it, should we keep? Uh, should we do a little raffle? Let's do it. Do a little raffle. Let's get a uh, time. First, let me remind people that this episode going on right now, we got the illegal sieve Kevin White raffle, which we are going to be adding the Zach Saracino and the Alex Midler board. So three illegal sieve boards. Kevin White, dude, illegal sieve, best dude, professional, straight up. Yeah, thank you, Kevin, for jumping on a, a little Zoom call with us. Yeah, Amazing, man. bro. Yeah. And the JP's Sosa board. I hope I say his last name right. I think it's Sosa. I think so. Two of them. Two of them, bro. Five boards? And they're signed. And these are signed, the JP Sosa so you boards. Can, you can choose to either like keep those. Yeah. Wall that. Or skate those. Five boards, bro. J.P. Souza, Alex Midler, Solid shit. Kevin White, Zach Saracino. Wow. Hell of a board. That's a hell of a raffle, dude. You're sponsored. You are pretty All much. new pros. Yeah. All pretty new. Much. All new. Nice big one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it is a nice big one. Uh, that's, a, that's a lot of tequila right there, bro. Is it tequila? It's a big old bottle. I would mm -hmm. assume so. Mm -hmm. Hey, shout out Visual Talk Skateboards, on, shout out Illegal Civ. Go check them out, IllegalCiv.com <coughs> and VisualSkateboards.com. Go give them a... Sir, shout out Steven Venasco. Hell yeah. 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 Yep. Shout out to my Valley, Valley Brethren. Valley legend. Straight up, 818. He's OG. Yep. Yeah. He's OG. Yep. And, yeah. Might as well. <laughs> Might as well remind people on the website. We got a signed LD board, signed Craw board, signed Jerron board, and signed Kelly Hart board. We got two graphics from Kelly Hart. Uh, how about that, man? Limited options. Hey, if them shits ain't sold out by this, what's the timestamp on the on the show? We're about, about one, they're, almost two hours. They're gone. They're gone. They they're gone. Yeah, they okay. gone. gone. We'll, I'll just put, put them back on the floor. Okay. Somebody, yeah. no, somebody already bought those. Yeah. I'm like, they're fucking, gone. if they're gone, I'm like, let's go. Oh, you're Duh, new here. Let's go. You're, no, Duh, you're this new This is like here. a whole new world to yeah. me. They're gone. They're gone. Okay. They're gone. That's how yeah. it works. Kelly might have a couple. Yeah, I was, I was just going to say, I might have a few boards on there. Yeah. <laughs> Not really sure. Some, Make sure that? Kelly's are gone if that's the case. I had to say pull one because it got smeared a little bit, but uh, it's, it's a casualty, man. It's a casualty. Yeah. That's a sick, I, I, I had a casualty. I had a casualty. No, that's just like, um, you. it was like an oil, oil painting. painting. Yeah. 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 It looks tight. Yeah. That's like the unique You should go over it with it. like another pin, like outline it. Oh, yeah. Should I outline this? You could outline 
Or bah. do it like that with a get like a gold pen yeah. and do it in the middle. They'll, they'll, be, they'll be the one with two Silver. signatures. <laughs> two. Or you yep. should just take that home with you, bro. I yeah. might do that. Hang yeah. it up on my own wall. It's kind of abstract. <laughs> 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 uh, it's a this little psychic. Wouldn't put it on <laughs> my own board and put it on my wall. Yeah. That is some Dude, that's psycho. next that's level. The next narcissism on a <laughs> next level. <laughs> Chris is over here oh, saying, my own board signed <laughs> on my wall. See my jokes, they turn into a whole thing. <laughs> uh, shout out Ryan Gallant. <laughs> Fuck you. Yeah. Uh, visit skateboards. Shout out chocolate skateboards and girl skateboards. Yes, yes sir. So Definitely, go, go check them all out, man. And uh, well, Tony Hawk. Tony Hawk. Man, oh, this is yeah, about to this, win some shit. Wow. This was gnarly. Going viral with that video last week, bro. I know, Tony. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta set, calm down, bro. <laughs> you, gotta calm down. you gotta let our, con- you gotta let, really... let our content ride, bro. Dude, Goodness. he for real had the da na na da na na. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. Dude, really Dan, did. Dan Rather. Yeah. Responded to his post on Twitter. I'm like, Dan Rather. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's so crazy. Thank God we were tagged in that, man. Um, <laughs> three Tony Hawk. We're, we'll pick these right now. Pick these right. Let's go. Or should we just pick the grand prize right now and then pick the other three? Nope. After the credits. Oh, yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> See, he's supposed to put eight commercials in that. I don't blame him. I don't know. I what think you should choose do? that last. Should That's the grand finale. Yeah. 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 I'm a team player, guys. Wow. There's I could barely lot. get to the bottom. There's oh, I fluffed it good earlier. Did you? Yeah. Oh, wow. I fluffed good fluffer earlier. right there. <laughs> He fluffed him up. Roger never goes limp. They're like <laughs> popping out the top. That's uh, that's. This is dangerous, yeah. bro. My, go ahead. Keep him down. Go ahead. Keep you guys want to pick? Go ahead. Four of us can pick now. Go ahead, bro. Oh, who's gonna be the I, odd man I out? I will be the odd man out because I'm always the one that gets the both. So go ahead then, bro. Okay. You want to L bridge it over L-bridge? there? L bridge it. Look at that, bro. Oh, don't show me, dude. Don't, don't show me. <laughs> You Wait, so are, I don't are, know. No, I'll pick last. You okay. pick. You want to pick the the grand prize? I would be honored, bro. Perfect. Okay. You Perfect. Know, Let's me, get it. You know, Tony Hawk, bro. Why? I get so excited when I get to choose. I these know. Things. Go, go, go. Hey, ahead. thanks. Go ahead. And I cut. Dude, oh my gosh. Yeah. This is like solid. Solid. Rock That's solid. What she fucking what? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for cussing. Sorry for cussing. <laughs> is that what she said? No. Oh. <laughs> Damn, this is a good Yeah, this is Wow, I gotta go to the bottom because I don't want anybody to feel like just because they didn't get fluffed at the top. I'm scared I'm gonna get a paper cut. It's a lot of shit in here. <laughs> oh, I fluffed it good earlier. Yo, this kind of hurts. Roger never goes limp. <laughs> God damn it. You got that. Oh, fuck. I gotta go back in. Jesus, what is going on over there? I picked there, one. It was two. Whoa. I dropped both instead of one. I oh wow. I don't know what's happening, man. There's too many papers in okay. it. Okay, I got go one. Ahead. There we Jeez, go. Jeez, Louise. There we go. Um, these three that we're going to try to read right now are for the signed Tony Hawk Birdhouse board. Just to be specific. Just to be specific. Yes. Yes. This is what you're three winners right now signed. Yep. Which isn't bad. Signed no. Tony Hawk board's great. Me? You know what I'm saying? Hawkman. Go ahead, Dubs. Go ahead, bro. All right. Well, this is uh, for Yeshua Arista. Birdman rules. He does. There Bird it is. Birdman simple, rules. Simple as that. Okay. Boom. Go ahead. I'll go. go okay. Ahead. Proud to say this one. This guy, he, he did some work on the chat last week. Official military skate. Get oh, him. Let's go. Oh, it man. worked. It worked. <laughs> and you... you you done did it, as Dub said. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Congratulations. Put in that work. Yep. He done did it. He done did it. He done did it. Steez is right. what? Wait, no, no, no. No, no. Oh, Save oh, it oh. for. Yeah. You're right. You're right. You're right. Yep. right, right, right. Um, last but not least for these Tony Hawk signboards mm-hmm. is Masquerade J17. Love from Tucson. Bay. Not bad. Not right bad. Out of Tucson, Arizona. Yeah. Yeah. Wildcats. Oh. Spread the love. You know the Wildcats are? Yeah, it is. You. Okay. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations to the three winners of the Tony Hawk signed Birdhouse board. Now we're going to pick. Oh, I still need that. Is it Zachary Sales, right? Yeah. It, okay. He put so, in that so work, many boards bro. over mm-hmm. here, bro. I got to write these down so I'm not, I don't get them mixed up. Yeah. Wow. 
My writing is horrible. As long as you can see it, you can understand. As long it. as you can understand it, yeah. yeah. Or Roger too. Ooh, and this, is the finale. this finale. This finale. Dub's gonna hold it for him. Yeah. yeah. Damn. There's a lot going on here. Wow. Nice. nice. All right. Oh wow. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> up here daniel c mm. daniel c he yeah. said if i win please give me the 720 board Whoa. Wow. Damn. It was fate. daniel c <laughs> i'm not gonna lie bro i am jealous of daniel c right now man i would love to have this board Dude, wow. So, Daniel, if you want to just give it to me, that's fine, bro. Yeah, just keep it. Yeah. I'll just keep it. Yeah. Daniel Castillo won. Daniel, yeah. could, you <laughs> could you imagine? It's amazing. Hey, um, please, all the winners, uh, Yeshua. Arista. Arista, mm -hmm. Birdman Rules, Official Military Skate, Masquerade J17, Love from Tucson, and the grand prize winner for the Tony Hawk signed, ridden, complete board, Daniel C. If I win, please give me the 720 board. Email us, contest at the nineclub.com. Send a screenshot of your receipt of the super chat donation that you received, that you uh, that you got when you donated, and send us your address all in one email, and we will get these out to you. ASAP. Mm -hmm. Just want to let everybody know that all the donations that we received last episode are going directly to the skate park project. In two hours, we received $2,800. Wow. Amazing. Amazing. I think that's pretty damn good in I two mean, hours. Yeah, right? yeah dude. Wow. 2,800 bucks. That's amazing. That's amazing. Thank you all. Yeah, yeah dude. Wow. I think when he, Tony Ebays, he's, he gets like, you know, 500 bucks. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. No, but that's amazing. So that's, that's all awesome, going to the man. skate park project, formerly known as the Tony Hawk foundation skate park project, $2,800 in two hours. So amazing. Yeah. Thank you everybody that really donated. Seriously. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. Seriously. Cause if you didn't win, you did win. You're building some skate parks for yeah. some yeah. 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 Cool, man. Real so shit. Yeah. the nine club and skate park. Possibly? Everybody is a winner. You're a brick in it. Yeah, that would be pretty break. amazing though. Real a shit. nightclub park? A nightclub park, yeah. There's a bunch go. of curbs everywhere. <laughs> you know, <laughs> that will be a part of it. <laughs> you know I'm down. Hey, congratulations to the winners. Thank you so much, Tony Hawk, as well. Yeah. Thank you, Tim Olson, for uh, you know getting all this together, giving the, us that peace and everything. Uh, really do appreciate it, Tony. Yeah. You're the man. You are the man. Tony, yeah, big shout out to with Tim, us, man. man. I don't know why, but Tony fucks with us. Skaters supporting yeah. skaters. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's what it boils skaters down to. Skaters supporting it. skaters. Man. That's what it boils down to, man. Shout out to our homie Tim Olsen. Yep. Yeah, shout out to our homie Tony Hawk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I call him Tone. Hey, what up, Tone? Hey, what up, Big Tone? <laughs> what up, Tone? What you doing, man? You eating those egg -o waffles right now? <laughs> what? <laughs> I call him during breakfast. That's why. Oh, okay. In the morning, you call him. Oh, I call him in the morning. Hey, Best Tone. Time. What up, Tone? Best time. So, <laughs> blueberry? <laughs> or buttermilk? You're insane. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, people eat blueberry eggos? Oh, they're delicious. I got it by accident one time. So that's why. Yeah. Accident. Mm -hmm. yeah. Instead of working out. Happy accident. Yeah. yeah. I loved yeah. it, bro. It was really good. <laughs> happy accident. <Damn. laughs> I love that. Sounds like a good though, time. Man. I got to yeah. sometimes, uh, I don't know if any of you keep your butter in the refrigerator no. which yeah. i think you should do right yeah, yeah. motherfuckers that keep butter on the counter that shit's weird it's you're weird. unless you're weird. going <laughs> unless <laughs> Jesus, unless you're going Milton. through it pretty quickly uh my family used to keep butter you, on the counter but we go through no. it pretty much but i i keep mine in the refrigerator yeah, yeah. no the thing with the eggo no. waffles not in the refrigerator no you no. keep it on the counter if there is a cover to it if yeah you have a cover you pull it off if you and you scoop it up on the butter or on the toast, it just glides all buttery. Well, that, <laughs> that's where I was going with this because even huh? a hot ego that comes out of the toaster, it's, it's you know, hard out of the, it's, out of the refrigerator. Yeah. You still got to. Once you spread, you, you nope. cut the fucking square, you set it nope. in the middle and you let the shit melt. Nope. No. Yeah. So what I do, mm. 
I cut some butter and I put it in a little cup, put it in the microwave, and I pour my butter on the mm. Eggos, bro. That, you okay. do that. You I do mean, that. that's okay. a lot of extra work. That's like, yeah, I do that with like crab legs. It's 20 shit, seconds. But... How's that extra work? You just put it on the counter. It I'd stays rather... right there. Boom. Uh, no. <laughs> it's easy. You cuss while talking about butter. Do you, do you, what, are you talking about the little the little brick? <laughs> yeah, the little brick. The little brick. Yeah, you it has like a you have like a butter. And you just let it stay out. And but it's, it's got a cover. Yeah, yeah, the cover. Yeah, and you take the cover off, and it's just like so buttery. Do you eat a lot of butter? Uh, not really. You probably okay. cook with it a lot. Yeah, I cook with it, but if you do toast, like it, I'd rather have like not like you go down on the butter, and then yeah. it's like hard to get on the toast when it's all cold and shit. Well, it, nah. is, a, it is a milk product, right? Yeah, yeah, there's yeah. dairy. In yeah, it. it's dairy. Well, what does that mean? So, yeah. Keep it in the fridge. You, you refrigerate, refrigerate it. it. No, that's why they make those butter. Like, and that's why they have a butter compartment in your refrigerator. But that's why they make the butter Yeah, but from back in like the old days, we've evolved. <laughs> well, we're also talking to a person that keeps Hot Pockets in his back pocket. So. I, mean, I don't do Hot Pockets in my back pocket at all. <laughs> <laughs> not <laughs> one bit. <laughs> not, not one bit. Uncrustables. Uncrustables. They're uncrustables. That's same, what they're Same, same, same fucking thing. Hot pockets. Same thing. Beast, bro. Same thing. Same thing. This is... I'm leaving. <laughs> Him and... Ham and cheese in the back pocket. It warms it up by sitting on it. I love this. I or is it this. pizza? I'm leaving. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Well, we don't want you to leave. This is ridiculous. <laughs> um, I can't just make shit up. <laughs> he's got the hot, hot pockets, pockets in your bag. Like, no, he's like, Dude, no, that's, that's actually, uncrustable. Sorry. That <laughs> might be up there with me signing my own boards hanging up my own wall. <laughs> that's just as crazy. That's what crazy. Hot pockets in the back pocket? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Just yeah. crazy. This is what we're talking. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we're dealing with. Uh, All right, man. They should do like a little. There were the blind boards with the kids. They're like the fucked up blind yeah. kids. Mm -hmm. Do that with us, and then like. Oh, we signed my own board. Somebody did. And then, Somebody did. Oh, you have hot pockets? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. They did it with the three of y'all. Uh, you know, updated one. Experience were, episode. Yeah. yeah. But the reason behind this, and I explained this, and Steezus refuses to like accept it. <laughs> <laughs> there was four people in the original fucking uh, uh, thing. So that's what he was going by. I don't give so a I get that. <laughs> but Steezus is like, nope, I wow. do not. Except that you should have included Jesus, everyone. Jesus, you're not happy for Dubs getting in the uh, mm, fucked no, up. It has club? nothing to do with <laughs> no, Dubs. Okay. It has absolutely nothing to do with no. Dubs. Who was the third one? LD? No. no. It, was it, was it was Roger, Roger and Kelly. Dubs, Roger. you and Kelly. Oh, the artist guy that yeah. did that? Oh, yeah, we weren't in there. Nah. But it, like, I'm trying nah, to tell you. Nah, nah, because he was I'm, a dick in the Nah, fuck that. He was a dick in the comments, so I'm calling him out. Whoa, bro. He was a dick in the comments? Yeah. When I, when I was, I don't remember. It was a while ago, but I just remember him being a blatant asshole. And I'm not like, I don't fuck with that. Damn. Mm. Okay. Well, well, I appreciate it. I, I love that artwork. Bro. I loved it. Man. I thought it was amazing too. That's why I wanted to be a part of it. But me and Eldie just get the fucking short end in the stick. Yeah, listen, mm. man. Sometimes, so sometimes I get the short I end in the you. stick. What are you going to do? You well, know, you got to give him ideas. Down. What would you be? Like, what would you be doing in your thing? It's not, that, well, why that, do we got to give him no, ideas? Yeah, you yeah, get the yeah. hot pocket. Now. You know what I mean? What? He's got that the hot pocket thing going for oh, him. Oh, I give a shit. No, no, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> like, well, that, was him, that was for him to come up with, but you know, yeah. I, I, like I said, going. I'm trying to. I'm trying to protect him on his behalf, but I see your. I see your point as well. He right. did do it. They were. They were good. They were they great. Were good. Yeah, they were yeah, good. You can't were deny. Good. But nobody. I was the only one who posted it. No, I, I, posted, I posted you. it too. Okay, I didn't see. This was a while ago. It. Yeah, it was happened a while yeah. ago. It was. I just months. Po posted it random, like out of nowhere type shit. I'm gonna hit up Tracy Tubera. He can do all of us. He, it's it'll be, it'll be it'll be incredible. I don't know who that is. He, Tracy uh, Tubera. He used to work at Fantasy Factory. He did Wild Grinders for. Oh Rob. wow! Okay. He does a bunch okay. of like um, DC comic stuff, and like he was at. Yeah. Wow. He does a wow. lot of big licensing shit. Perfect, bro. Yeah. That'd Shout out, Tom and Tubera. Fuck, I forget the other guy's name? name that did Tracy that. Tubera. Tracy Tubera. <laughs> Tama Tubera. <laughs> it's actually really sick, though, because he's got uh, triplet boys. And every morning, well, when they were going to school, every morning on each of their lunchboxes, he would do um, a post-it note where he would draw like an image oh, of sad. all three of them. And at the end of the year, he would show all the ones that he did. It's oh, really sick. fucking rad. Yeah, it's that's really awesome. cool. Well, we're at the end of the show. We're running a little long tonight, but that's okay. That's okay. Eldridge, do you have anything else to take us out of here with, bro? What do you got? I, I actually do. I actually wrote something. Hell yeah. I actually I wrote it. something. Um, when I was in Florida, I had this little, uh, it was so it was like, I've been now three episodes. I went on vacation for a little bit and I uh, had 
something happened to me uh, via Instagram. They, I had some comments come at me. I was posting a lot of golf. Oh, you know, I'm getting mad. you okay? They're getting mad at the golf cart. Mm-hmm. They, they, no, they were a little, they were a little weird. Mm-hmm. So, no, what, what, what's going on? I, no, it's all good. But I, I, I wrote this. I was in bed one night. I was like, you know, I'm gonna fucking write some shit. And I'm going to say this on the nine club, and I haven't said it until I thought tonight. I'm Let's hear it, bro. Say it with your chest. Okay. Just airing, our gr- <laughs> airing our grievances here tonight at the nine club, Let's bro. Go. I love it. And I might, I, I don't want to cuss, but can I cuss a little bit? You already did. Now you ask? You're asking us? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, so is this, this called this, something? No, this okay. is just me talking, whatever. All right. So stop giving a fuck what people think. If you want to do heel flips, all your friends are doing kick flips. Do heel flips. Guy by the name of Neem Williams, most beautiful heel flips in the world. Do you. Stop giving a fuck about what other people think. If you want to be inside playing video games and all your other friends be outside, do you. Play video games. Old buddy by the name of Felix Chilberg. PewDiePie. PewDiePie. $30 million net worth. Do you. Stop giving a fuck what people think. If you are a woman and you want to play in the dirt and climb in hills and all your girlfriends want to, you know, do makeup and talk about guys, do you play in dirt? A woman by the name of Junko Tabe was the first woman ever to summit Mount Everest. Famous as hell. Do you. Do what the fuck you want. All I'm saying is that whatever makes you feel good, do you. At the end of the day... The bottom line is whatever makes you happy, do it. Don't worry about what other people think. Don't worry about what people say. Do you. I started a golf company because it made me feel good. Skateboarding makes me feel good. Golfing makes me feel good. I feel the same way when I'm golfing as when I did when I was skateboarding at the prime of my skateboarding. We still skateboard. I still skateboard, but golfing it just makes me feel good. So that's why I do what I do. So more power to the people that just do what makes them feel good. And that's why I, I love say. that. Very nice. Mm-hmm. I like that. I don't usually do rounds of applause. That was good, dude. Thanks, nice, man. That, that was a beautiful little, like... I like the passion behind yeah. it. Yeah. yeah. It's important, man. Oh, it's you know, We all worry too much about what other people... You know what I mean? Like, it's yeah. crazy. It doesn't yeah. matter, dude. Because I... Hey, Go ahead. No, I was gonna say I, I got flustered by the comments that people were saying, mm-hmm. and then I, I I just like took a step back and was like, I, I don't give a fuck because I yep. feel happy. But you don't even yeah. know these people, right? Who yes. are these people? That's that's yep. you know what, what? Why have somebody affect you that doesn't even that you don't even know? Exactly, it doesn't yeah. make sense. Yeah, but do it that. does affect you. But it gets you know, to you because you, you see it's repetitive. You but see it all the time. Right. That, you can get ninety nine beautiful comments, and that one comment mm-hmm. that talks shit, mm-hmm. you're like, it you fucking, stew on it. It mm-hmm. feels it, you feel it. You ignore all the beautiful ah. comments. That's something that I've personally made a point of. Of like on my Instagram, I'll respond to all the positive shit and leave the motherfuckers that are talking some like out the side of their neck shit. I'll just leave them alone. Yeah, like, so why, why, why would you respond yeah. to them motherfuckers? I, they, yeah. They're just wanting that attention. Yeah, but yeah. to your point, man, I love that because it's like, I don't know when it became a thing where skateboarding was the only thing we're ever supposed to fucking care about. Right. right. You know what I mean? Like you can have passions and loves and other things outside of skateboarding and still be a part of that community. Of course. Yeah. Skateboarding makes us better. Like it, the fact that we have mastered an art that is the hardest thing to do. Fuck, I mean, soccer, all these sports are super hard to do. But if you can kickflip on a skateboard, you could fucking do anything in life. Straight the hell up. Anybody like, can run up to a soccer ball and kick it in a goal. Anybody, Not everybody can walk up to a skateboard and do a kick. Dude, you yeah. could shoot a basketball. You could do anything. Like, no, uh, no. and I'm not no disrespect to right. any sport, but right. like the what we do is the hardest thing you can do. So if you can take that into other aspects in life, dude, more power to you. Yeah. Let's go. Most more likely to succeed, you know. Straight up, mm-hmm. people that write stuff like that, they they have their own problem. That's really what it comes down to: is yeah. they have their own issue, and that's why I learned over time. So I don't really, I don't ever lash back. I'm like, oh, dude, you got you got something you got to mm-hmm. figure out. And also, too, you know, you, you, it's hard. Yeah. I mean, every, he may have a bad day. 
Right. Yeah. You know, and he's just taking, and then nine times out of 10, you hit him back like, Hey bro. Like, and they're like, oh, I'm so sorry, man. I'm so yeah. sorry. Yeah, yeah, you know? Yeah. And you're just that's like real shit. That, that's yeah. exactly what happens. What? Yeah. yeah. I think sometimes though, it, and I've learned, I've been doing this on my Twitch where you'll get those people that just like come in and it's, it's consistent or they repetitively say something and you got to teach people how to treat you or how to talk to you. Mm. So sometimes I won't snap, but I'll like, I'll let them motherfucker know about themselves real quick and be like, this ain't it. This, I, I ain't the one. Don't mm -hmm. come in here with that shit. Right. Either come in and be positive and have a good time and talk with this community or get the fuck out. You right. ain't boo-boo the fool. I ain't boo-boo the fool. <laughs> I ain't your little homie from around the corner. Like, don't come talk to me from like you crazy. The Straight boo -boo up. The fool. And I know I'm very positive and I have a lot of that, like, you know, it's all love type shit, but sometimes motherfuckers take that shit and think they can talk to you any kind of way. Right. And I know yeah. you feel that shit too. Yeah. Right. So at the end of the day, it's also up to us to let motherfuckers know, like, yo, you're, you're, I'm not your friend like that. We can be friendly, but don't come at me crazy. Right. You don't know me. You don't know me. If you got a problem with me, call me. If you don't have my number, you don't know me well enough to have a problem with me. Right. And, yeah. But just think True about that. this, though. This is, okay, sure, we are on a platform that goes out to, you know, hundreds of, th millions of people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hundreds but, of millions. But, <laughs> <laughs> but at the end of the day, this happens to everybody out there that's on social media, no matter if you have like 100 followers oh, yeah. or 12 followers or whatever, whatever you're putting out there, people are going to attack and that's fucked up. Mm -hmm. right. You know what I mean? Yeah. So it's not just us saying like, oh, because we're on this platform and blah, blah, blah. We're getting, you know what I mean? Right. It's like, yeah. no, no. Everybody goes through this. Mm -hmm. You know, we imagine growing up in high school or something, having to deal with bullies and mm -hmm. people on your social media. Like it's, yeah. it's a big it's thing. And, and to it's come a big thing. full circle with this episode, watch how you talk to people because you never know what they could be battling in their own minds yeah. and what you might say could be that tipping point. There you yeah. Go. yeah, exactly. Amen. That's real shit. Yeah. Uh, Jerron, what about you, bro? Anything uh, to lead us out of here? Man, that was a heavy shit. Right <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know oh, bro. It came to me first. Dude, I Eldie is like, man. you gotta find like a path in slam poetry, man. You had, like <laughs> the passion slam, was there. That was good. I, yeah. You got me lost right there. Man, I'm like, Damn, do I'm you, you up right there? If yeah. you want to play in the dirt and you're a girl, go climb Mount Everest. I was like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Man. <laughs> I can't even follow who, that who up right that? now. <laughs> who knew that he could I'm write speechless. such a good haiku? Oh, uh, man. LD. He's, he's back with visions. He's back with visions. Are you going to pass? Yeah. You're going to pass again? I don't like to <laughs> fucking pass, but no, I'm mean, at the end of the day. I'm about to celebrate my birthday hey, tomorrow. Happy, hey, happy yeah. birthday, dog. Hey, dog. Hey, guys. Hey, happy Hell birthday, yeah. bro. Man. Uh, 32 another, years old. Dude. Hey, he's younger wow, than me now. Man. 31. 31. 31. 31. <laughs> I'm talking about. Um, I apologize. Another year around the earth, and um, I'm very thankful to be here with you guys. Mm -hmm. Very thankful for my family. You know what I'm saying? And, um, very thankful to be a skateboarder, man. First yeah. and foremost. Yes. We're thankful for you, big dog. Straight yeah. up. I Thank you for you, being man. a skateboarder because you being a skateboarder made me want to be a skateboarder. Yeah. So thank you. All of us. The hey, powers of this shit, man. Not for nothing. Like what he said times 10. Yeah. Like mm -hmm. representation. I'm, that means a lot, man. Yeah. Straight I, up. I didn't see too many of myself growing up. And, you know, um, the people that I did see it, it, it just skateboarding itself, it just I just seeing somebody skateboard, let alone seeing somebody like me, um, was a beautiful thing. You know, I, I was definitely just energized and just so fond of it like just seeing it for the first time so look at, at the end of the day i'm just very thankful to be here yeah. thank you guys nine club course, is bro. fucking the shit yeah. thank and you, i bro. continue to carry that flag and i love this shit man thank you it, for being just a fucking you. amazing human man literally people love say that guys. thank you for being you literally the most draw thank you for being you <laughs> no I, like, likewise for everybody <laughs> in this room you know what i'm saying like i think we all carry this really special energy that you know obviously skateboarding carries that 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 forefront for it but i mean we're all here for a reason and you know i'm very i'll say this fucking weekly i'm, I'm thankful to be here man yep. yeah you know and i am thankful for all the people involved that you don't see on the camera too yes. you got tim you got justin not you justin another justin jc mm -hmm. Justin crawford tim yes. Olson, mm -hmm. raj behind the scenes man there's a you know we're growing this this pond mm -hmm. and it's it's i'm so thankful for it's a powerful, it you know? powerful, powerful group of people powerful man. people that want to be involved trying to turn this motherfucker into a lake it's mm -hmm. crazy mm -hmm. then crazy to, a, to a river into a, a motion ocean. sea and <laughs> yeah the ocean, the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> what about you steezus you touched on something before but uh any oh yeah yeah um i just want to give an assignment to the people out there reach out to somebody you haven't spoken to in a while whether it be via text phone call friend family member check on somebody 
That's, that's what go. I want to leave you with. There you go. It's a good Beautiful, assignment, bro. For mm-hmm. real. Mm-hmm. Kelly, do you have any? Um, well, the jump rope thing's already done. Yep. I said that earlier. <laughs> yep. Um, that's, that's done. What else? I got a, a promo code you could use oh, yeah. on. <laughs> 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 on Just Live Kelly 15, you want to get some CBD pills? Woo! That Jeez. shit works, bro. Yeah, shit Just works. Live. Let's go. Prebs. Prebs. Holler at your boy. <laughs> <laughs> um, I got some new stuff work we're doing with Richter. Uh, we're working out for a while now. We're just, we did a lot of cool things. We're starting to put it out. So be on the lookout for that. It's been really fun to work with, work on with rad people in HS. Um, no, but I, I, I'm very, I was, what the drama was saying, I'm super blessed to be, I'm very happy to be here with you guys. Like this show has brought me so many other things too, other than just hanging out with my boys. It's, it's opportunity. So thank you, Raj, Chris. And of course, bro. Thank you. You know, I haven't been able to skate that much. Or I, I've started skating a lot recently again just because of injuries and stuff. Someone said to me the other day, like, yeah, thank God you got the nine club to stay in the in the skate industry while you're hurt. And I was like, yeah. I mean, no, I it wasn't necessarily to be in the industry, but I felt more in touch with skateboarding than yep. I ever have. And yep. it's crazy that Preach. I haven't been skating like, like I used to because, of, like I said, the injuries. But being around talking with everyone, it's, just, it's been unbelievable same yeah. so yeah, i feel mm-hmm. the same way bro yeah, like too. i as being at my height of like skating every single day i feel more in touch with skateboarding now than i did then in a weird way mm-hmm. yeah mm-hmm. likewise so it's true i just want to say thank you guys and thank you chris for thank you bro. having me be part of this of and course, i want to shout out specifically sorry i didn't mean to cut you off here i specifically want to shout out roger because if it wasn't for roger putting all those things on the list every week i know we do it's a collective but mm-hmm. roger eats sleeps breathes skateboarding and if it wasn't for roger i wouldn't know what the fuck's going on in the skateboard world right now at all so <laughs> roger i know you're <laughs> man in the shit back there but thank you bro default, default by instagram but yes 1000 percent being on this show like i i'm informed on these these weekly fucking videos that i would not be exactly. watching instagram so, is like the pocket of definitely. people that we pay attention yeah, yeah, to yeah. but yeah yeah, the sh- the the kickflip five o backlip on I wouldn't no, what never in no. my life would have seen that. But it's no also doubt. the smaller videos. It's That's the smaller yeah. videos. Yeah. It's yeah. the independent videos yeah. that if we didn't do the show, we maybe we would watch a Godspeed video. We keep right. up to yeah, date, yeah, of course. Yeah. But the independence yeah. that yep. Raj finds and like off it, the it's radar, a, I would never, yeah. ever yeah. know who any of these people are. Nope, he's yeah. probably watching a skate video right now. And and switching happen. cameras. Yeah, yeah. What are you watching back there, Raj? I think it's a switch with Manny. <laughs> Roll the credit, Rush! <laughs> <laughs>